and we're live welcome back everyone to another live stream uh today i will be sorting through what you see over here as best as possible uh sorry about the angle really i didn't want to kind of like um take the little setup away because i, I feel like it's easier doing it, doing it like this because of uh the angle of the camera so Gonna have you guys a little bit distant wise away, but you know, I'll just be chatting with y'all and you'll just hear this in the background. And also because Lego is pretty loud, so um, I didn't want you guys to get, um, you know, ears hurt <laughs> if you're wearing um, earphones and such. But uh, Sinker Bricks is here. Welcome, thank you so much for coming. I do stuff, you know, Brick 101 and Glory Brick Productions. So thank you everyone for coming in. Can I join today for Google Hangout? Hangout, Hangout, Hangout. Um, no, not today. Uh, today's not going to be a community stream, especially it's super late. Um, I'd say some other time. Um, we'll see about this coming weekend. Uh, I have a lot going on actually this coming weekend, so I'm going to see what it can do. But I have promised you guys um, some community streams, so we'll definitely try and do that this weekend if it's possible. Uh, Brick Boy Builder 18 Animations is here. Welcome. Thank you so much for coming. It's not late. <laughs> it's 820, man. 820. It's crazy. All right. So there is a lot of non Lego in here. So I'm going to have to um, sort through pretty much all of it uh, to kind of get a grasp at what exactly I have here. And this will be a video eventually, um, maybe like a couple of days if I am able to sort through all of it. So I can um, make another video updating everyone. How much is not Lego in this whole thing? That's ah, okay. It's not so funny, man. It's 4.20 plus 4 hours. That's what time it is. Should have been Brick Builder 14. Should have been. What do you mean, Scouter? Welcome, Scouter, by the way. Thank you so much for coming. You want to have the name um, Brick Boy Builder? <coughs> I wonder what I should do with all these uh, fake Lego parts in here. Gonna be interesting. Maybe try and build something and then during my like, uh, years just blow it up somehow. I think that'd be interesting. Or not somehow, you know, rockets um, or fireworks, any fireworks, I guess, would really work. Since there's quite a bit over here actually, but only the buildable things, you know, um, that connect, not like the wood and stuff that are in here and like. Uh, these little pieces or whatever this is. Um, let's see. Why does Lego sound like a waterfall? I don't know. I, I'd say it's like a more painful plastic waterfall than a waterfall, really. Um, uh, I haven't heard a waterfall in quite a while, but it. I don't know. I don't think it's waterfall-like. Um, so how is school, PW? Um, Pretty good. Last night I found out that I actually got 88% out of 100 on my um, math test, which I was like, hmm, I don't think I did very well on this, but surprisingly, I did. So that's awesome. Splat uh, Productions is here. Welcome, Lisa, for coming. And Coletti Bricks is here. Hola, everyone. Welcome. Thank you so much for coming. Coletti Bricks, glad they're here. And Muffle, Muffle. Full quartz gaming is also here. Welcome, thank you so much for coming. Uh, it's uh, it's 720, you know it? No, it's not 720. You know, I wish it was California time actually for me right now. 523 would be amazing. Yeah, I got a 75% on my math test. Cool, cool. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, that's passing grade, so you know, that's pretty good. Uh, same with uh, my sociology test, I got a passing grade, which I'm not too happy about, but um. I saw it coming, I guess. <laughs> so it, it's fine. You know, uh, I had to, uh, um, I had to study, <laughs> and I didn't. I didn't study very well, um, probably because you know it's like in the middle of the day. I had uh, a couple other classes right before it, so I couldn't really study all that much um, leading up to uh, the time to take the test. I guess. What is this? Oh my. This is so weird. I don't know what that is. Like a shell? I think it is. I think it's like a shell. Hearing uh, a mom in the background, so hopefully, background, hopefully you guys can hear that. 
Uh, it's five here. Oh, nice. Okay, so you are in California. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> I don't know what's up with this one. There's like this little brick attached to that. It's not Lego. Um, so, yeah, it's a little nasty. I'll, I'll put its own little section of nasty bricks. Okay. Hold on, Lego. Over there. All right, let's see what we got. Uh, the Smurf Slayer is here. Welcome. Thank you so much for coming. Um, Scalper has a face. Uh, let's see. Passing grade is always. Uh, I don't know what that is. I'm sorry. Um, it's 18 images. Hey, how are you? I'm going uh, to make a tree for my city on Bricklink. Nice. Uh, interesting, I guess. Unless you're talking about the stud IO section, which in that case did not make sense, I guess. Um, pretty good. How are you? Hey, what are making? Welcome. Thanks so much for coming. BW, you're streaming over your friend. I am. Who, who else is streaming? Who is my friend that is streaming? Streaming. Uh, I'm streaming. Rick, Rick Master is. I didn't know that. <laughs> when did he start? Oh, he's using OBS. It's pretty cool. 19 minutes ago. When did that happen? Okay. I did not get a notification, oddly enough, which is very weird. Oh, what a bit you ask him. Have you met BFAB or Brickworld's a person? Yes, he has. I'll answer for him, but he probably will answer or something like that. Uh, yeah, I didn't know that. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't realize I didn't get a notification for some reason. I don't know. Uh, Josh K is here. Welcome to Sculpture Cohen. Uh, let me switch to my Lego channel. Okay, cool. Uh, let's see. I want to work on Wakanda. Ooh, you like want to work on Wakanda. I wanted to do a Wakanda mock, but that fell through with a lot of other things. But, you know, I'll eventually get to being able to build a mock again. Hopefully. Nerdbrick on the one is live streaming. I thought you were here, Nerdbrick. Evan 2 Gaming is live. Is he your friend? No, he's not. I messaged you on Google Hangouts. You did. I thought you had um, sent a message on Instagram. Wanted me to join a stream yesterday or something. Okay, let's see. Nope, I do not see a message on Google Hangouts. But welcome back, Josh. The, uh, is that graph? I want to make sure. Giraffe. It is giraffe. Mm. I never looked at the spelling, I guess. Uh, let's see. God, I guess I'll listen to Paul. Oh, All right, well, do, do what you, uh, you want. You can stay here, stay there, or listen to both, I guess. That'd be uh, very confusing, so you wouldn't know what exactly would be going on exactly, unless one of us doesn't really talk all that much, which I hope I will be uh, talking quite a bit, uh, maybe even more than him. Uh, with all these comments coming in. Keep up the chat, guys, so that we can continue talking and girls. Ooh, clutching bricks is there. Sorry. <laughs> There's got to be an international sign for everyone. Um, people, I guess. Persons. Some, someone. Is this Lego? Yeah, I think that is Lego, actually. Um... Let's see, I gotta change my name a well, little. Yeah, the Lego giraffe, uh, your profile picture doesn't look like a Lego giraffe, so I just say Josh, the Lego creator, or something like that. Um, and also, yeah, I think you would have to take the Lego part out of your name, uh, because Lego at some point probably asked you to do that uh, in some threatening way, probably. Let's see, I just finished the set for a video uh, for Lego Batman 08's contest. Lego Batman will also have to change his name eventually. Uh, let's see, I'm going to watch you on my phone and him on the PC. Oh, the other guy, Brickmaster? Or is it um, Evan 2? I think you're talking about that. Uh, well, was school? Oh, jeez. How was school? Uh, second question, how was school? School, I guess, we'll, I'll talk about today instead of what I said about tests. Uh, today was pretty good. Um, not too bad. I almost fell asleep in my sociology class, um, which was crazy. 
it was just uh, it, it became so boring that I was just just like one uh, closing one of my eyes to try and see if I could um stay awake in a way. I, I don't know. It's very difficult when we're to that point. Maybe I should try and pick up some energy drinks, like uh, start using energy drinks too, see if I can uh, stay awake longer. But you know, it was like at the closing minutes, like uh, I think it was like fifteen minutes left or something into the last, and I was just like, I uh, just uh, starting to doze off and such. So yeah, got to deal with that every now and again for that class. But the other two classes that I take uh, pretty much keep me engaged the whole time, so that's you know awesome instead of having to um, you know, deal with uh, sociology, uh, which you know I definitely have to pay attention very well in sociology in order to pass these uh, exams, which I have another three exams, so I gotta make sure I get good grades with those or else I'm not gonna pass the class. But um, you know, I'm sure I'm gonna pass it anyways. Oh my God, what the heck is this? It's like a big plastic piece. Almost looks like a crayon, but it's not. It's so weird. Oh my god, what? what is this monstrosity? Is that glue? Someone used Kregel on Lego and non-Lego? I don't know, it looks so weird. It's not Kregel because it just came apart pretty easily. But we're gonna put that over there anyways. Um, which of these other parts? Man, there's so much to go through here, it's crazy. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, actually, it might be blue or ooh, okay. I'm throwing that away. That's done. Actually, that, that part's done too. Man, <laughs> this is not turning out too well. Rebo Bricks is here. Welcome to you so much for coming, Rebo Bricks. Really appreciate it. Okay, I'm back. Welcome back. Uh, I'm not going to be able to have my mock in time. My pieces and figs I ordered as soon as you announced the contest still aren't here. And even if they come tomorrow, it uh, it'll still be too late. Rip. Oh, sorry, man. I really think so. Um, let's see. I think I, I said the 21st or something. Um, I don't know. Maybe you guys can remind me, but it might be actually a little bit later because the 21st I actually have to upload my mock for the collaboration with uh, Betalug, which I already took the photos of and it's completely destroyed now. So um, I'm going to try and uh, get that mock um, edited and such and put it together and then post it to my channel, which is not going to be very long. It's not going to be a very long video. It's probably going to be at least a minute and 30 seconds possibly because of how they want me to edit the video together. Uh, it's just like, it's it's going to make it very short and I don't like uh, making videos like that. And also, oh, oh Rebo Bricks, don't need a dollar. Thank you so much, Rebo Bricks. Um, kind of talking about beta love right now. It, it's nothing negative about beta love, of course, but it's just like you guys have a, a strange editing style. I guess it's uh, somewhat professional or like you don't want to share your voice, kind of. But um, for me, I'm just used to like um, talking, um, being a, um, oh my God, commentary, how to um, talk commentary during the whole video. So it's going to be a little different, so I'm going to try my best to make it somewhat uh, too par for uh, beta look, but uh, we'll see, see how it turns out. But thank you so much, uh, Repo Bricks, for the $1 donation. That really means a lot to me. Um, definitely is uh, really awesome. <laughs> thank you, Donny, man. Um, okay, let's see. We got a few comments in. Let me uh, check them out. Hey, Brick by Brick, welcome. Thank you so much for coming. How's it going? How's the college life? I think you started it already. Uh, let's see, Rick Rolls, what a pretty sweet and free thing you got. Yeah, actually, it's pretty cool um, getting you know free parts like this. I think uh, after I you know go through all this, clean it up a little bit, I'm probably going to be giving this to my baby brother um, so that he can play with it and such. Uh, of course, you know I'm going to take away all the um, stuff that really is badly damaged and such. Uh, he might you know somewhat damage it all, but you know this will be awesome for him. You know he can just build whatever he wants out of it and um, you know it's just like a nice free surprise for me and then gonna be a, a nice surprise for my brother and so I promised him that I'm giving him some of my Lego I actually did give him some of my stuff uh, the first thing was fake Lego um, because I had a bunch of fake Lego under my bed at uh, my dad's house and then um, I gave that to him but of course fake Lego doesn't connect very well so 
I'd like to give him all this uh, so that he can have his own little collection that he can hopefully build up someday, which uh, I will try and give him something that's like brand new. Um, <clears throat> but, you know, Lego, I don't think does uh, many of the uh, creative boxes like this anymore. Other than like, the Minecraft box, which I think is really cool. But um, the other stuff, uh, like I don't think you really do all this stuff uh, anymore. Uh, like boxes, they have boxes, but not like these tubs. I um, like whenever I first got to Lego, they had like this big blue tub that you had like uh, thousands of parts or something in, or you could fit thousands of parts in, and that was really awesome. That was a really amazing tub, and they also did like the same uh, tub for duplo parts as well. But uh, those back in the day. I really like those because, you know, you can reuse them for anything, though, except for this one. This one's uh, really dusty and such. I might be able to clean it off and such and maybe put all this in there for him. But um, I, I don't know. It's, uh, you know, dusty and such and old. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I wish Leo did that type of stuff again. That would be pretty cool. Uh, school is school. Boring as uh, watching a 12-year-old uh, unboxing toys. <laughs> okay. So at school, it felt like a 12-year-old unboxing toys. That's interesting. I would expect that to happen at school. Uh, let's see. I talked to a girl, my crush, about Lego, and she didn't judge me. Ooh, that's pretty cool, man. Hopefully, um, hopefully there's a ne uh, next step for that. That's that's cool. Lucky wouldn't. Uh, I showed my crush my Lego channel, and she cringed. Lol. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you should show your um, your channels to uh, the people that you like and such. Uh, today, I almost slipped out and said, uh, um, during my sociology class, uh, my teacher was like, oh, uh, well, I, on uh, Facebook, have like uh, 200 friends or something that uh, that talked or that we follow each other or something, but I don't talk to all of them. I don't know any of them. And I was going to say, like, it's kind of the same situation for me with my YouTube channel. Like, I have so many people that I follow and so many people follow me. I don't really know them. Well, you know, it kind of relates, but I would get to another little branch and he asking, oh, what's your channel? So they want to get to that point, but it does have the same meaning. You don't really know these people all that well. Um, well, I know quite a few of you actually collecting bricks, uh, BFAB. Uh, those uh, I know like for a fact that I know quite a bit about uh, personal life and such. Um, and I've shared personal stuff with as well. Let's see, if it's later, let me know. Yeah, actually, um, I think maybe Sunday, was that the 23rd? Uh, yeah, so the 23rd, I, I guess I'll, you know, post a video or something. So I, get, I think that's like two extra days maybe for you? I don't know. Uh, hopefully that's enough though. Aw, uh, you boys are cute. <laughs> If it's later, let me know. What a bacon. Uh, I don't believe you all uh, want me to call you. <laughs> I only show people my channel if I think they would cringe at, at it with me. Cringe with you, okay. <laughs> I showed one guy my channel and he likes my content. I don't know why though. Yeah, that's like one time uh, uh, when soccer, like uh, two seasons ago or something, I... I slipped up and like kind of revealed my channel to uh, a couple of players on my team. And then um, one guy actually just subscribed to my channel. I don't think he's subscribed to my channel anymore, which is good. Like I would rather him not be subscribed to my channel, but that was a little weird. <laughs> Let's see, I'm, uh, I'm serious, Josh. There's, uh, he ended, what did he end? That's weird. Apparently what a bacon, uh, can you give, can you give you, uh, oh, sorry. Bacon, can you give guys plenty of tips with ladies? <laughs> hey, Eric, how's it going? Uh, you have any questions or concerns about the video? No, I got it figured out. Uh, the screen recorder or something on my phone. Um, got it, like, working-ish. Um, which is a little weird. I don't know if I can show you, but, uh, you know, it's on there. <laughs> you can't really tell, but got it working. So, pretty cool. So I can uh, edit the video together real quick and uh, get that published to my channel uh, on the 21st, of course. Uh, let's see. But welcome to Dora Studio, Lego Studios. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, don't give him the knockoffs. No one deserves that. Yeah, I wasn't going to give him the knockoffs out of this. But uh, from what I had that was, uh, you know, that I could spare at the moment, uh, I just gave him those knockoffs. Uh, so 
kind of really stinks. <laughs> he uh, he makes little airplanes and such out of uh, the knockoff stuff, and then it just falls apart really quickly and gets frustrated over it. So I feel bad for that. But, you know, hopefully he can build something better with all this after I get done sorting through it. Uh, sorry about that. It is just uh, more professional to have a slideshow instead of somebody talking in the video. Apologize for it. No, 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 man. It's okay. I understand completely why you guys want me to do that. I, I even mentioned that. Uh, it would be more professional, but it, it's just like uh, what I'm used to doing. So that's okay. Yeah. I'll um, transition into that for the collaboration video. Let's see. If any of the pieces are fake, like Lego burn them. Yeah, actually, uh, for 4th of July, well, not 4th of July, that's forever from now. Um, for New Year's, uh, I'll plan on like using like rockets or something to blow them up, something like that. I don't even have good advice. I just be myself. That's good, man. Uh, good thing that you have confidence around ladies like that, uh, being yourself. You can make uh, another video with uh, commentary over it. No, that's okay. It's already gone. <laughs> It's already gone, man. I already have the photos, so that's good, but um, it's all gone. Welcome back, Nurebrick 101. I saw that you went live. How was your live stream? Uh, he already took it part. <laughs> oh, man. Yep, just reading the comments. So, oof. Oh, oof. Yeah, yeah it's gone. Um, <laughs> let's see. You know, burning plastic would end up dangerous, uh, dangerous in his household. Uh, go find a store that sells weapon and then burn the lock up some what? <laughs> or I should just send it to um <laughs> send it to uh um geez what M and R Productions like uh, all this stuff that in the background here, this is not Lego. So what if I just send that to him? That would be funny. <laughs> oh man. That would be uh that would be pretty interesting, but um hopefully it wouldn't have to pay for shipping. <laughs> I don't know. I could go to the um the post office that uh, he goes to, you know, to pick up his uh, uh, PO, PO box stuff. And I'll see if I can uh, just say, hey, can I put this, or can you guys put this in his PO box, or do I have to pay for shipping? Because, you know, that's like, it's five feet away from uh, the teller, so, you know, don't know. We'll see if I can uh, probably do that, that would be funny. Uh, did you see the Leap 2019 modular? It's a post office. I saw the, um, the what was it called the the winter post office i didn't know that there was a modular that was a post office the creator modular that's pretty interesting though you know coming up with a um, winter village post office and then now a creator post office um which you know it's pretty cool uh because you know why would they have a post office before uh, it's it's great that they're finally coming up with the post office stuff I don't know, like I can't remember exactly, but I'm pretty sure that they have like mailboxes and such all around the post, um, the cities, city creator buildings and such. So it's really awesome that they finally are doing the post office side. Let's see, he didn't say anything negative. I think he was just uh, concerned about his video being too short. Yeah, that, that was a reason too, but you know, most of my videos are pretty short, but it's going to be definitely like a minute, 30 seconds or something like that because of um, just having photos like that. And I gotta find some good music to put in the background like that, uh, like a video like that. Uh, hopefully, something good, royalty, royalty free, royalty free, so I can uh, make it work. That is uh, the best advice. Uh, hey, it's Briggs is here. Welcome to Summer Coming. Uh, what do you say there? Do you know me? Yes, I know you. Um, haven't seen you around for quite a while. Hold, hold on, I'm about to sneeze. Okay, I lost the sneeze. Uh, hopefully, it comes back because I would like like to get that out of the system. Oh, man. See, what I'm saying is that it, it it was as boring as a 12 year old unlocks and toys. I hate both of them. Oh, okay. Understand now. Thank you. Thank you for clarifying. As long as it's uh, 50 seconds long, that's enough. Plus, the intro adds eight seconds. Yeah, let me see how much the eight, uh, intro is. Oh, actually, yeah, I think the intro was eight seconds. It was like 18 seconds before I was able to edit it down. Oh, yeah, it's nine seconds. So it's pretty much eight seconds, I guess. Um, congrats on 300, uh, Nurebrick. Yeah, congrats, uh, Nurebrick. Uh, I'm so glad that you made it to 300. That's really awesome. Now you have 300 spots behind you, and I have 1,600 and six, just say 1,600 spots behind me. So all you guys, your spots, we have a huge army of spots now. It's pretty cool. We have 15 Spartans, uh, which you guys, I guess, will be the officers then because there's only 15 of you there. So glad they're here. That's, uh, what is that? Is that 10%? I think that's 10%. Let me see. 
or maybe actually no, that that's probably one percent. Actually, we went down to fourteen. Darn it. <laughs> Let me just see real quick. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> yeah, I think that's one percent. But yeah, um, why would they say ten percent? That ten percent, I think, would be a uh, hundred and fifty. Okay. Um, guess that makes sense. I just tried to uh, try not to add fake because then I will be fake. Yes, you'll be fake. You know, I, I would like to try that once. That would be funny. Or, you know, it wouldn't be that funny, but see how it would be if I acted like I was someone else. Uh, but I don't know. You know, that might have consequences, actually. Because, you know, the, the, the world that we're in right now, social media and such. Oh, look out for this guy. He lied to me. He, he told me that he was Robert, and he's actually Eric. What was he doing? Yeah, so... I don't know. <laughs> Definitely don't be a fake you. <laughs> Try to be um, you. Let's see. Have you seen Deadpool 2? What do you think about it? I have not seen Deadpool 2, but I've actually seen a lot of the YouTube videos about Deadpool 2, so I actually know quite a bit about Deadpool 2, and I know what happens in Deadpool 2. Uh, not all the parts, of course, because, you know, YouTube doesn't, or YouTube videos don't show the whole movie, but um, I've seen most of it, I guess. Yeah, let's see. Do -do -do. Yep, I'm Mark. Uh, thanks, Wooden. Uh, I know no one in real life that likes Brick Filming. You know, I know no one really in real life. I, I'm saying here, man. I don't know anyone in real life that likes that, too. Uh, let's see. Why are you so behind on the chat? It, it just always happens like this. I'm sorry. Let's see. I would be myself, but I am myself. I think I got nine people, maybe, or like five, but it was cool. Nice, man. That's pretty cool. Uh, currently, we have 12 people. We went from 15 to 12. Uh, you know, it's always like that. It's always like uh, some people come in and some people leave because we're like, oh my God, what is this guy talking about? Uh, Lego. That's so stupid. Uh, you know, I don't know why they're subscribed to me in that case. Lego Post Office, uh, every kid's favorite place to go. <laughs> Lego Post Office. Uh, I think it's every Brooklyn gear's favorite place to go is the post office. Unless they are able to figure things out with uh, just putting a label on their packages and leaving it by the door. Flick Brick is here. Welcome. Thank you so much for coming. I never knew Brick, uh, Nerd Brick 101 streamed today. Yeah, he just streamed a few minutes ago. Eric, seven minutes behind as usual. Uh, right now, four minutes. I'm catching up. Don't worry. Uh, Benjamin Mines is here. Welcome. Thank you so much for coming. Yo, I'm only six subs away from 1K. Nice. Congrats, man. Hopefully you can reach uh, 1K. That would be awesome. Uh, let's see. 130 is perfect. Awesome. Uh, I don't know if it's going to exactly be 130, but fingers crossed. <laughs> I don't know how many photos I have exactly. But, uh, let me check, actually. Uh, 4, 8, 12, 14, no, 13, 13, and 8, 8-second eight intro. I don't know. <laughs> I can, hopefully, fingers crossed. Uh, let's see. Um, let's see, I'm so hyped. Waiting for this uh, for a year. Waiting for what? Uh, check out uh, NCS for good background music or an Ender Gunny Gunny. Okay. Uh, I'll just look at royalty free stuff because I like some of those uh, those stuff. You know, there's like a Goblin from Mars or something. He's he's got some good content. I'm nine subs away from 70. I'm surprised. I have more than four subs. Yeah, that's awesome, man. Congrats. Uh, hopefully you can reach 100 here soon. But definitely, whenever I like first started off, uh, I kind of spoiled myself in a way. I um, I did a giveaway like whenever I reached 25 subscribers or something, and I jumped to um, uh, 150 plus pretty quickly. So I never got the actual experience of gaining and earning those subscribers which I really hate doing giveaways because of that. Um, um, you know, some, like, 10 people watching right now, and I'm, I have 1,600 subscribers. Uh, this should be, in some way, like, 20, like, 20 concurring viewers. So, um, you know, I kind of messed up my my sub uh, amount. I think if I did not do the live streams, or, sorry, not live streams, the giveaways, I'd probably be at... Um, a thousand maybe a thousand subscribers because like 600 of my subscribers are fake uh they only came for the giveaways and they forgot to unsub afterwards more than likely that that's like the case for most of them but some of you guys uh you come for the giveaways and then you stick around for the videos because you 
you start to like the videos. So that's great. So I'm glad uh, that a lot of you stick around for my content, my actual content, so the giveaways themselves. So that's really awesome. So um, that's only one thing I regret with uh, starting off my channel with giveaways like that. I should have done it whenever I had a milestone. Excuse me, milestone instead of just trying to gain subscribers quickly. So that really screwed up the little system, I guess, in a way. But you know, uh, it's nice being at 600 subscribers like I am right now. All right, let's see. Thanks, Brickle. No problem, man. Uh, let's see. I am It's Bricks. Uh, this is my second channel. Oh, okay. Click Brick. <laughs> it's Click. Click Brick. Okay. Well, welcome again, uh, It's Bricks. Let's see. I can't wait to get uh, the Bricktober Infinity War pack on my birthday. Awesome, man. Uh, isn't that like October 18th or something? 12th? Uh, I think it's around that area. I, I saw like someone posted that it would only be out for like five or seven days, something like that. I forget who it was. If I can find it, then I can give you like the stats of like all, all of them. Um, I think it was Lego Team Builder. Let me find him. <coughs> Oh, no, he, I guess he made a video about it. So on his channel, he posted like uh, everything about the Britover sets. So um, it's pretty interesting though, because it's like only, or actually no, that that's right. Uh, Britover sets are only throughout the, the month of October or something, but every week. So that makes sense then. But hopefully they go on retail sale after that, because I think you had to spend $70 or more in order to get one of the sets, which isn't that bad because in, in a way, because the, the sets themselves are worth 20 bucks. I believe uh, so that would in turn say that you're spending at least fifty dollars kind of getting it um, so you know that, that's pretty cool all right let's see I can't wait okay so I have 129 129 subscribers that's awesome man congrats let's see also my crush was helping me with uh, work in class Ooh, that's nice man she's uh, helping you out that's pretty cool you know I did have the crush in my class but She's starting to uh, turn a little bit, so I'm not really liking her all that much uh, now. But um, you know, we'll, we'll see how things go. Because I, I, I did say that if I can get to the point that I am uh, confident with my body, then I can go up and ask her out. Uh, but we have like ten weeks left until the end of the semester, so fingers crossed that I can lose the rest of the weight. Um, I have was it. Uh, or 42 days left into my birthday so at that point is when I wanted to have um, you know a, a good a good starting point or actually no I have a starting point right now a good ending point with uh, my weight loss journey uh, definitely tomorrow I'm gonna be trying to fix up my diet to even better because today I did have a pizza and um, uh, some cereal and a cookie or actually two cookies so <laughs> That really stunk, but um, you know, gonna try and uh, switch it around. I did buy chicken, but I had to cook it in the oven, which I am not really keen on doing. I hate cooking um in general, but uh, cook cooking with the oven, I'm just horrible at like cooking uh, frozen pizzas and such. I, I cannot just have it all cooked. Like for some reason, it just does not cook all the way. So sometimes I eat the cheese raw in the pizza and such. So. If I cook chicken, I really need it cooked all the way. So, fingers crossed that um, whenever I get this diet going, I'm gonna do chicken rice or a chicken wrap or something. I'm gonna be able to kick, uh, cook the chicken all the way. All right, let's see. Nice one in my crush is not in my class, sadly, uh, but PE. Ooh, PE. You can show off in PE though. Uh, let's see, I don't have a crush, uh, crushed. I don't have a crushed because I have the uh, inability to feel love for you. Oh, geez, man. George Peels is here. Welcome to the for coming. Anyone go, uh, going to watch the SpaceX live stream? It's in 10 minutes. Really? A SpaceX thing? Okay. Uh, let me look that up real quick. I'm going to move the screen over here so I can uh, still look at the chat. Uh, let's see. But welcome, George Peels. Thank you so much for coming. And the chat just skipped away again. Uh, so I am. Uh, have you seen the trailer for Bad Times at the... No, I have not. Uh, I don't know what that is. B202 is here. Welcome. Thank you so much for coming. Appreciate you hopping in. Um, okay. Let's see. It, it was awkward because I had to shake hands with a girl who has a uh, boyfriend. That's not bad unless uh, the boyfriend sees you shaking her hand or something. 
Uh, let's see, Slayer, are you, uh, are Smurf Slayers not capable to feel love? Also, if you are a Slayer, does that make you a serial killer? Those are royalty free, I'm pretty sure. Okay, well, uh, I'll look up anything that has royalty free, I guess. Uh, see if I can, um, you know, get anything rolling then. Um, right, get started on all that. Um, Rebo, are you still there? Uh, B202, she hates being called. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Thank you, Pino. Uh, no, it's because uh, you human humans have idolized Smurfs, and we can only love loves what you humans call animals. <laughs> okay. Let's see. I, I'm a fake sub. I'm only here for your contest. That is that I'm not entering because I'm late. <laughs> oh man. Well, that that's fine. Uh, you're here for kind of content because it's not like. Um, uh, like, not everyone can win that. And I've already got kind of like two people in my mind that officially are going to be winning uh, a slot in the uh, the three. Uh, but I will be, um, you know, giving a little shout out to everyone that does enter. Uh, there is this one guy that I think has a really awesome build. However, I do not think uh, he built it. So I'm not going to be putting him in as a winner. Um, you guys can probably tell who it is because... Um, his mock is pretty amazing. It's like a floating island or something, but I don't think it's his. Like, uh, since he's not talking in the video and such, it, it, it kind of throws me off a little bit, like uh, suspecting if it's his or not. So I'm suspecting it's not his. So that's why he's not going to be a winner in, that, in the contest. Um, geez, King Lego. Welcome, King Lego. But that's that's crazy. <laughs> I'm not even going to say that. Uh, see, I'm building a big slash my kind of uh, big World War, I, World War I mock. Awesome. Pretty cool, man. Got to go. I'll be back in 20 minutes or so. Okay, see you, Rebo Bricks. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, and no, I only murder Smurfs, so no, it's uh, it makes me a warrior in my culture. <laughs> Jeez. I'm so excited for the next voting. Most people we've ever had apply, uh, and a lot of them. Seem pretty goof. <laughs> oh, good. Okay. Well, are they gonna kick me out? I've been uh trying, trying my best in the uh, the group, but um, you got people like uh Celtics or it's not Celtics. Uh, whatever his name is, it's so weird. I'm just gonna call it crystals. <laughs> uh, it kind of kind of resembles some things about crystals. So yeah. Um, all right, let me look up SpaceX real quick. If they have a rocket launch, I can take you guys outside uh, to, to go watch it. Um, so let's. Is, is it? Gotta make sure. Who, who mentioned SpaceX? If you can let me know what you think it is exactly. Um, let's see. SpaceX has signed the world's first private. Oh, okay. Uh, our launch vehicle. I don't think it's a launch. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'll just keep it in the background, I guess. Um, let's see. Drew Keen, uh, Lego, what a bad type of all. Yeah. Um, I'm doing very difficult, uh, different videos on this channel. It's a good way for me to express myself and to enjoy editing. Awesome, man. That's pretty cool, man. Glad that you're doing something different. Um, you know, always trying new things is definitely awesome. Except for, you know, trying to do the same thing over and over again. That's when you get burnt out, just like Lego Bagel and Dalek Bricks. I guess Dalek Bricks is kind of coming back if he uh, is trying to come back. I mean, Lord forbid uh, you shake hands with the girl picking. Did you just call me? <laughs> I never eat. I never eating dinner at your house. My house. What is it? <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> About the uh, the part of it not being fully cooked and such, yeah. See, I can't shake hands with a female. <laughs> Let's see. Wouldn't uh, know he's saying that it's not a big deal. Yeah, it's not a big deal. Uh, but it might be awkward um, unless it's like mandatory. It's like something that you have to do. But um, if you just like go up to a girl like, "Hi, how are you?" That's a little weird trying to shake their hand like that. Um, and at least in my case. Um, unless you're like boyfriend or girlfriend, but he would, he would hug at that point, <laughs> I'm guessing. Uh, let's see, do do do. 
you made it sound like a like it was bad do chill uh oh beep two zero two but uh for me it is because i am so used to shaking boys hands you know in the business world it's not only boys or men uh it's boys or men and women so you gotta get used to both i guess if you're gonna be involved in the business world i am a what is that <laughs> Symbiote. Symbiote. I don't know. Symbiote. Even though my profile pic says otherwise, I just find the species interesting. <laughs> okay. Uh, I built it on stream, on your stream. That wasn't, I wasn't talking about you, Nuremberg, when I was talking about someone else. Floating island. You didn't build a floating island. Most people don't talk to, in my mock videos. Most people don't talk in my in mock videos. Sorry. Okay, got it figured out. Um, I talk in my mock videos. Look at my uh, most popular one. I talked in there, talked there for 12 minutes, and it's doing phenomenal. Uh, let's see, I don't think Smurfs exist. No, they do not. Uh, let's see, Ethan can be a bit uh, tough. He's really hard. Oops, did it skip? Or, yeah. Oh, there it is. Uh, are people's building skills don't take it personally. Yeah, I don't care. Um, I'd rather, rather do what I want to do and what my viewers would like me to do i guess like uh what they like see me build i guess <laughs> something like that however i'm not really a builder at the moment because of um you know school work business i am i'm just doing so so much at the time at this moment that it's uh pretty difficult to try and pick up uh more building see how can you kill smurfs if they don't exist uh this first layer smurfs exist uh they live in with the fairies in my garden uh you don't see them because my friend has hunted them to almost complete oh all involved i just uh sent a message so let's see construction.rga mail um i don't think you're meaning construction i think uh extinction um well it's awkward shaking hands with anyone for me <laughs> Yeah, well, if you are like a slightly awkward person or just like little look a little out there or something, it's, it's just a little awkward. You know, their facial expression with uh, shaking your hand might be a little different than what you would suspect. Uh, let's see, I'm a. Uh, oh, let's see, thanks for that knowledge. I shall commence a hunt on this verse in your garden. Little collecting, I'm a play, uh, so I can uh, give you all tips. <laughs> I know that Bud, uh, my close friend from school, is getting rid of his Lego so he can buy a new car, and I'm getting uh, his 2006 Java sale large for $50. Ooh, that's a pretty nice deal right there. Are you busy to talk? <gasps> I think I'm streaming right now, man. I don't know why Lego Pony 97 is trying to contact me. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm streaming. I've not talked to this guy in forever. I don't know what he wants. Um, yeah, yeah, it's pretty crazy. I've pretty much sold almost my whole entire collection. Like, I got down to a point that I only had like a few buckets of what I had uh, throughout my whole life of Lego. So I was like really proud at that moment trying to get down to that point. I know it's like a little weird for you guys because you're all Lego lovers and such. Uh, I, I am a Lego lover, of course, because you know, I have Lego right here. I'm trying to, trying to sort through it and I'm talking to everyone uh, that loves Lego as well. Uh, it's just, like I'm growing up, uh, things are changing, um, so it's it's a little difficult to try and uh, <laughs> uh, to try and um, you know continue building such. And my creativity is completely gone, so uh, it's it's a little rough. <laughs> and I'm in a lug right now. <laughs> um, see, most small uh, to medium mock builders don't talk in their videos. More professional. Fine, I'm not professional then. Just call me non-professional worlds, okay? <laughs> if that's what you want. Finds his keys here. Welcome to summer. Come. Uh, BRB, I have... <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I have dig... Brick. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if the D and B are supposed to be backwards, but something like that. Don't... Didn't know you were streaming. You didn't reply to 10. The two T tax T tax. Okay, so you're talking French or something there. Um, okay, I reply. I'm streaming. <laughs> uh, let's see. 
<laughs> Sorry, man. Uh, but you can join in if you want to. Uh, why is the SpaceX thing the digger not working? I guess it's not uh, rocket launch, so we're not going to launch a lot rocket launch today, guys. Uh, everyone, stop talking in the chat so we can catch up. I was pretty much caught up. I was I was reading everything. I should be practicing for theater right now. Uh, let's see. Uh, if he catches up, he ends the stream. Don't let him get caught up. Yeah, that's exactly what happened the other day. Like I got caught up, and everyone just stopped talking. So continue talking, guys. Let's keep this conversation going. Uh, well, no spamming. Uh, <laughs> don't spam. Uh, just have a communication or a, uh, uh, just have a communication, a conversation. That's the word with everyone in the chat. Oh, that will be great. Urgent. We, we win. Oh, we win. When we win. Jeez. Uh, growing up is not a um, not a good excuse. What? Growing? It, it is an excuse. You know. Whenever I get uh, get to going into career wise, that is a big excuse. I got a lot going on with that point. At that point, um, let's see. I've thought about selling mine for more important things, but I don't think I'm ready yet. Yeah, if you're not ready to do it, then you know, like, don't do it. Like, if you love Lego and you have a, a um, you have a good budget, affordable, or not affordable, um, you have a good solid income. Okay, he'll join. Um, then you can, uh, you know, continue purchasing stuff. But for me, I, I just I do not have a solid income that uh, is consistent, so I seriously need the extra money from uh, selling my Lego to stay uh, plausible uh, in life uh, to pay all these bills and such. Like, I have a few bills coming up, which I've been talking about multiple times before, or many times before. So, um, yeah, I'm just trying to get the extra money in to pay for those, which I almost have. I almost have it already. So, hopefully, here soon. Before the bills come in, I can uh, pay for them all. Let's see, I think uh, in my videos, brah, I, oh, I talk in my videos, brah. I don't know what I said, think. Uh, let's see, that you are. Those buckets uh, were cool back then. Yeah, the, the Lego buckets, uh, I really liked. They were really awesome, but now they just do the boxes and such. Uh, except for the Unikitty thing. I think the Unikitty, they have. Um, uh, they have a little tub thing in the jigger, but uh, the big boxes of just like thousands of parts or something, those were really, really awesome. You know, you can create whatever you want with uh, whatever you got in there. I also hunt the dragon creatures called Wasps. Everyone stop talking, so he will end stream. Why do you want me to end? How rude. Why didn't you text me? I already know you're streaming BW. I didn't text only you, I text BFAM. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> Um, let's see, wait, Vines, is BFAP confirmed? It's been confirmed. Uh, Spider-Man PS4 is great. Has anyone here played it? No, I have not played it. I've only played, I think, two Spider-Man games before. Um, but that was so long ago. And I think I really liked those back then, back in the day. But, um, I, you know, you played one Spider-Man game that had, uh, the same villains as, uh, right now. And you just say that you played them all, I guess. <laughs> I know it has like better graphics and such and a uh, better storyline probably, but um, yeah, I'm sick of games pretty much at the point. Uh, but I do want to play Blackout. I think Blackout, you know, a Call of Duty game, Blackout would be amazing, but I think the beta is already over. So whenever the game officially comes out, I would love to play that. I think that would be really awesome. Uh, we can't confirm or deny that. Um, let's see, Collective Bricks, Name for Field, JK. Uh, I do stuff. I played it at my friend's house. It's fun. Uh, the first Spider-Man game I played was a Spider-Man 2 on PS2. Yeah, that might be the game I played. I can't remember exactly. Okay, so 10 watching and 13 likes. Thank you guys so much for that. That is really awesome. And the chat is dead again. This always happens, but hopefully, oh, excuse me, hopefully BFM pops in here. And we can um, have a conversation with him, I guess. But since it's like this now, I can get over here and uh, start sorting again. Uh, why does your voice sound scratchy? It's because I'm a little sick at the moment, so like uh, I have a little sore throat at the the time being. You know, I can probably take more minutes and kind of like uh, the past two streams or something. I took shots in the stream with uh, the medicine. I think someone sent me a screenshot of me taking a shot, which was very interesting. I don't know why he did that. No way, uh, it isn't dead. I'll be RV. I'm gonna spam beef up on Twitter. He's, he texts me, like, uh, you know, some, where are you at, bro? Oh, you know what? Actually, he's probably at, um, 
he's probably heading home from work. I think he gets off. Oh. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> yeah. See, so this is what happened. I've been I've been so tired all day today because I got up at 6 a.m. to clean. Well, once I got off of work at 6 a.m., I decided to clean for three hours. And so I just got all of a sudden tired after cleaning. But I'm like, you know what? I'm tired of my dirty room. So I made it really clean. You know, three hours later, I just fell asleep and didn't wake up till uh, I started texting you and collecting or whatever. And I fell back mm -hmm. asleep again. And I'm like, hey, you streaming? Then I fell asleep <laughs> Again, then I'm like, I looked up, I'm like, oh, it's, you know, like 6.30, I wonder if Brookwells is going to stream, so I asked that you don't respond, and I'm like, okay, I'll just wait till he responds, and then I looked, I'm like, oh, let me just check YouTube, but he's not going to stream, and you were streaming, I'm like, god dang it. <laughs> yeah, I try to mess with you sometimes, but, um, <laughs> yeah, we're streaming. I've been collecting, and, and you know the photo of collecting that, you know, the, the photo, you know, <laughs> that's hilarious, where did you get that meme with that, that big guy sliding across the, the, the <laughs> You always have the the best memes. I was dying of laughter. I'm like, what the heck? <laughs> Here, I'll show everyone what we're talking about. Uh, it, it was hilarious. Uh oh, <laughs> <laughs> I was just, I was laughing like crazy. Like, dang, I'm like that. That's 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 funny. <laughs> Yeah, it's just like a little thing that you have with iPhone. So get get an iPhone. You can have Maybe I will. I think it's time for me to switch phones. And hopefully you guys can't hear screaming in the background. <laughs> can you guys hear it? Yes, slightly. Shut up, I'm streaming. Oh. <laughs> let's see. Let's just end the stream before Beef Up joins. Too late, he's already here. Uh, let's see, drink lots of water. It's very good for you. Question mark? <laughs> You're asking me? <laughs> Yes, water is definitely very good for you, um, and I, I've been just taking medicine and such, trying to get over the sickness. But um, yeah, I've been sick for like a week now and a couple of days, so hopefully I can get over it here soon. It always happens like that. But right now, I don't feel too bad. I feel like it's almost gone, so that's good. Let's see, have you guys seen um, Toon Bros, Dawn of Jar Jar series? No, I have not seen that because it's funny. Uh, let's see, he's probably eating as usual. Uh, hey, BFAB, what's good? Uh, clean, haha. -ha. We all know you don't clean long. Yo, what's your issue with him? The photo of uh, Wild Elder Beast. I uh, hear it uh, pretty well. <laughs> you hear the yelling. Welcome, Angel Mio. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, let's see, switch to T Mobile and get Netflix for free. <laughs> uh, a AWM, BFAB's in the stream. More people will join in. Yeah, we got 10 people watching now. That's pretty awesome. We had a 1.15, so hopefully we can get back up there. That'd be amazing. Hey, Brick Golds, can I enter my Arena Fire amusement park ride into your mock contest? It's 18 by 7 or more if you count the power functions and ladder. Uh, you already made a video about that, though. So you, uh, in the video for entering in, you would have had to mention... Um, um, my channel in the contest and also having the hashtag in the um in the title that that's the way to enter like a few people uh said that they are entering the mock in but you know that's not the rules like you got to follow the rules switch to at t for absolutely nothing in return <laughs> i got at t <laughs> i like it though at t is pretty cheap 28 dollars a month i pay for my phone which is pretty awesome and unlimited data so Dang, she is so loud. I chucked something in her face, so hopefully she stops talking. Wait, what? You chucked something in her face? No, I just threw a shirt at her face. <laughs> That's crazy, man. Let's see. <laughs> uh, now I'm going to think I'm mean to my mom. Like, oh, yeah, hey, stop screaming. She just kept here. just chucked a shirt in her face. So she's kind of angry at me right now. <laughs> like, you're going to be in the eye. I'm like, sorry. Switch to Sprint and get Hulu on ya. <laughs> on ya. Let's see, is this uh, going to be a private or public stream? It's public. It's going to be public. Uh, as long as nothing happens, uh, it's going to stay public. Let's see, Brickworld's, uh, oh, I forgot that I had to mention you. Sorry, I guess I'll be skipping this one alone. Yeah, sorry, man. That's that's okay, though. Or, I guess it's not okay for you. But, uh, yeah, no, no problem. Let's see, BFAB is so mean to his mom. Yeah. Slightly mean to her throwing a shirt in her face. I think that's what he said. See, at t slowed down my unlimited data, so I so now it barely works on campus. 
on campus, like uh, going to college or something, you shouldn't have to have unlimited data on campus because uh, most campuses have like uh, their own towers and such, their uh, wireless towers. So whenever I get close to the wireless tower, uh, whenever I'm on campus, I, I have unlimited, or I have uh, internet. So you should try and uh, see if you can find that. I hope you guys can't hear, I'm pouring a, a vitamin C drink right now. So if you hear the fizzing, that's what's happening. No, I just hear like a candy bar wrapper being open. Oh, no, it's actually a vitamin C packet. I'm pouring vitamin C in sparkling water. So I don't know how that's going to work out. <laughs> Hopefully it's going to I thought you were older than me, Josh. Wait, I thought, wait, Josh isn't 13? Oh, wait, never mind. I, I, I thought... This is not the guy I'm thinking about then. <laughs> I oh, yeah. uh, maybe maybe I'm wrong, but I always thought Josh was like 13, 14. High school. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, it's not the guy I was thinking about. Never yeah. mind. Sorry, Josh. <laughs> I forgot who you were. <laughs> I, I knew he was younger, so I'm like, yeah. Well, do you know this other Josh? Uh, I forget what his name is exactly, but um, he's like from California, and his uh, city was in his uh, parents' cafe. And uh, on the internet, or on, on news or something. So that's the guy that I'm thinking about. But I guess it's not this guy. <laughs> sorry, Josh. College is soon, lol. Yeah, sorry. I thought you I thought you were this other guy. So a couple of days ago, I went outside for once. <laughs> then I went to a football game with my dad. And I have T-Mobile and I think you're saying T-Mobile. And there was at least 300 people there. And... I had four bars. Nice. Uh, let's see. He is mean to me. Yeah, he's me. Let's see. I'm not that much younger, and I'm not. And I'm from Tennessee, not Cal. Yeah, sorry. I thought you were this the guy, though. Sorry. Uh, can I join in? This is not a community stream. On Saturday or Sunday, I'll try and do a community stream. It's probably going to be Saturday, actually. Oh, my goodness. My mom is so loud. Does anybody have a baseball bat? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Oh, geez. <laughs> you ready for another beef app video? How I beat my mom and went to jail. <laughs> that would be a crazy video. Oh, that would be a crazy video. Oh, that'd, that'd be so screwed up. Though. <laughs> Is he harassing you again? Looks at BFAB and gets out. Baseball bat. Ooh, he's got a baseball bat. <laughs> I'm too nice to Collecting Brick. Collecting Bricks just plays the victim. He's like, he's mean to me. I have I have in my chat. What? I see all the time. You're like, you look like this guy, this girl. <laughs> well, you need to join in the chat. You can help roast collecting bricks too. I am not a roaster. I only join in the fun. <laughs> you send the best memes. So. Yes, with the memes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was hilarious. That was so unexpected. I thought mine were funny. Then also, you sent yours. I was just died of laughter. <laughs> just slide about hello. <laughs> Hello. I was about to ask if that was collecting bricks in that individual's oh kid or something. <laughs> you said, I have a sledgehammer and I am uh, in my garage for you. <laughs> Super cool. It's really it's, uh, you said, is mean to me. <laughs> Even Wait, you know, uh, collecting bricks did a couple days ago. I was in a call and then all of a sudden she decides to like leave and not even say anything. She said she said bye to me, but she just like left. I'm like, where? I was sitting there I'm like, what happened to the call? I don't know. I don't know. She like might have just me. got over you. Like what she did with me on my own stream. She just flipped me off, ejected me from my own stream. Let's Talking see. Bricks is a pro at that. <laughs> Welcome, Brick Sailor, by the way. You said hello again, so I don't know if I said hello, but uh, thank you so much for coming. See, Brick Holds. Uh, okay. I read that. Uh, Brick, you don't harass uh, my, my Swiss door weak dad. Hits your knee, knee uh, kneecaps with baseball bat. I think he was just trying to type that as best uh, as quickly as possible. Collecting said that's not what happened. I have no idea what happened. I literally like like what I, like I was so confused. Uh, so I'm like, what did you did you actually say? Why did we just I'm like? Oh no, you said you wanted to go to sleep, so I said bye and hung up. Did I say that? Oh, oh, I didn't. I didn't. Even... So maybe I was talking to myself for a couple minutes. 
Two <laughs> 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 just you weren't looking at the screen, and you thought you just heard, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought I had. Yeah, I got to do the accent. Hello, I am collecting bricks. Welcome to the. <laughs> 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 I don't know. It's like Mexican and Italian together. <laughs> I just tried to do Russian, but that did not work. Oh, Russian. Okay. Well, I thought you were trying to do the Mexican. <laughs> Let's see. What would you do if someone made a YouTube poop out of you and it? made you laugh you know i forget what the youtube poop is but um it's it's kind of like making fun of you um like i know he asked uh prince oh i keep oh, so used to saying prince but but blood bat Lego pony said that he wanted to make one for me and i'm like yo man i'd like to see it i'm not gonna you know freak out and strike down the video i'm not that you know if it's done and fun and not trying to be like oh bfab exposed video he didn't send out his giveaway prize or something like that which i mean you guys could easily do that because Two people are still waiting on the giveaway prizes. Um, but yeah, you know. <laughs> I still need to send out ultimate bricks. Is. It's just like, you know, I kind of did this test, and this sounds kind of mean, but I'm like, oh, hey, I'm going to share your prize on Friday. And he hasn't commented on my videos in months. All of a sudden, he starts commenting on my videos again. And I'm like, you know, that's how you call it what a you know a giveaway gold digger is. You know, like obviously he does good work for you know him winning, but that always just pisses me off. Would, pisses you know, off. would you would you interact with people and then all of a sudden? All of a sudden oh no, I can hear oh, my no, ugly, hear voice. ugly voice. Um, um, but when you like, but when you like with interact with, oh, plug it my bigger. Trying to, trying to get my headphones. You said you wanted to go to sleep. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, okay. Ah, ah. Are you trying to get it? Um, but like, um, when, but like when it's all tangled. I'm sorry. I've tried. Come on, work. Okay, there we go. So like when you, so like you when know, you, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So like when you all of a sudden you're like you know. You don't talk to somebody. They don't comment on your videos in months. And all of a sudden, oh, yeah, I'm going to ship your prize. All of a sudden, they start commenting on your videos again. And you're like, are you kidding me? You know, and that, you know that's always happened with, you know, Ultimate. So I'm like, I feel kind of pissed off when that happens. So that's why, like, you know, Sula, she got her prize within, like, a week and a half of winning. But mm -hmm. she's always commenting on all my videos. So I feel like an obligation to get the prize out as soon as possible. Well, you know... Then another individual won one of my, you know, giveaways. And I said, hey, make sure you're at a stream on Wednesday, right? So because he said that he liked the video, I said, you need to show me proof. He didn't said he couldn't show me proof. He said there was a glitch. So I said, you show me the proof. Make sure you're here on Wednesday. Didn't show up on the Wednesday. So I'm like, yeah, if you really want the prize, you'd show up on the Wednesday. But then I also <laughs> said, I told the person, yeah, I'll, I'll give you another chance next stream. Show me what you're trying to say, right? But... It's not really that it's I'm not really asking for somebody to walk on water, but, you know, ultimate did what he was supposed to. But I'm just being a, a scumbag and holding out as much as possible. Like I could order it right now, this second. But there's like there's no motivation because when you see people just like do giveaway, like only show up to your giveaways when they want stuff, they don't comment on any of their stuff or they start commenting on your stuff. Once there's a new giveaway or this or that, I'm like, dang, people are kind of scummy, you know? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Like they uh they win the giveaway and then they unsubscribe afterwards, like uh spit bricks. It's horrible. You know what's weird is he follows me on Instagram now, so like he even commented on my recent Instagram post. So I don't know if he resubbed, but it, that means the subscription would be private now, or if he only follows me on Instagram. I don't know, but uh, he I don't know. He he was scummy for that at that moment. I was like, you know, you're a piece of garbage. Uh, but I think he's okay now, you know, kind of don't hate the guy anymore that much. Um, <laughs> so, you know, uh, I don't know. But it's like, I just think that's kind of scummy. Like, Brick Rolls, if all of a sudden I win your giveaways and I completely stop commenting on your videos, right? I still comment on your videos here and there. I don't comment on all of them. But, you know, you still know I'm alive and I still show up to your live streams, still interact with you. I don't just like vanish like, oh, well, I won Brick World's giveaway. Let me not talk to him for three months. Then all of a sudden show back up when he has another giveaway or when he says he's going to ship my prize, you know? 
Yeah, I understand. That's the same for me. Like, I don't comment at anyone's videos anymore. I, it's just a little thing, except for Evan Art Productions' video the other day, because um, he said that his uh, title had a meme in it, but I looked up the meme, or tried to see if there was a meme of it, but there was not a meme. It was not a meme, so I, I just had a comment. So, like, um, yeah, that's the only thing. And that has, like, over 10 likes or something on it right now, so that's pretty crazy. But, um, yeah, like... Um, Definitely am not like a big chatter anymore of uh, commenting on people's videos uh, or streams or uh, I guess the streams, yes, but videos, no, not really. But um, uh, you don't have to comment all the time on my videos. I understand that you're live and you send messages uh, mean to Collection Bricks every day. So I see them, so don't worry. You can join in. I'm not one to be mean to anyone. I'm not like that. I don't feel good after being mean to someone like that. Uh, all I did was ask if, you know, I think today is being nice. <laughs> you saw uh, my comment. Yeah, you asked, uh, do you like big man? <laughs> big man. <laughs> Don't she ask me that. <laughs> I asked I thought she asked, you asked her. No, she asked me that. I Well, well I said she, well, yeah, kind of. I mean, I said she likes, you know, bigger, yeah, you are. I did say something well, to some extent of that. Um, but then I asked her if I could get invited to her and whatever it's called wedding. And then she didn't respond. Yeah, I don't know where that came from. <laughs> well, because, you know, she so showed us a picture of that person. You know, I'm not saying names for safety reasons, but you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but I don't know how you got wedding out of that. Oh, I was just making fun of them, saying that they were in a, <laughs> Okay. And also, how... Uh, oh, wait, no, I guess she would know. Um, how... Um, how Ninja Blade got that photo, because I looked everywhere. <laughs> you probably don't want to say... Oh, okay, never mind. If, uh, I didn't say the name of the person. Uh, fair point. Fair Ninja point. Blade got it somehow. Um, Sprit Bricks did that. I'm gonna unsub. No, you don't have to. If you like his content, just stay subbed. I mean, he follows me on Instagram, so I feel like like kind of redeems it a little bit. <laughs> just so. slightly. Let's see. Hides behind you. Be fab. Looks like he should uh, be robbing someone in an alleyway. <laughs> Oh man, let's That's see. Wait, good. that's good. <laughs> Maybe I'll do that. Hey, Trevor, welcome. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, I tried to comment uh, often. Hey, Trevor. Uh, hi. Uh, does anyone know why the uh, this light in the sky is? What? What the light? This light in the sky. What light? What light are you pointing to? Like the sun, or the moon, or the stars? I don't know. See, it was on his vlog for Roller Coaster Release BW. Oh, was that an old one then? Roller coaster release. Undercover Gen Blade. Dun, 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 dun. I'm gonna go check out his channel. Real quick Here's the thing. I, I I'm not trying to say anything bad, but he might be lurking on your stream. To be honest. Who? The person. <laughs> you never know, but um, you know, we don't. He doesn't. Or I guess she kind of revealed it there. <laughs> 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 he might know after that. <laughs> but, yeah, uh, let's just hope people are kind of slow here. Um, let me see. What was it called again? What, what is, is that? Is BFAB's Instagram dead? <laughs> uh, no. I don't think so. <laughs> hmm. That seems like it was months ago, maybe. I really thought that he kind of looked like collecting bricks, but I didn't want to, you know, say anything. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I have no idea. I've I've only seen her like uh, I don't know if her profile picture is like very old or something, but you know things might change. But I don't know exactly. Yeah, I don't see that video. <laughs> I don't I don't know. There's like only live streams I see. You probably just went into like an extreme search um, or whatever. Like <laughs> probably took them like days or weeks to find that. Yeah. Like why? Oh, why? I, I'm not trying to say that. I'm not saying it's bad, but why does people just go and look and like find a little reflection and be like, "Oh my goodness, I saw him," you know? Yeah, they're just trying to find someone or find uh, what they looked like because they haven't revealed it themselves. I think I found the video. Let me go through it real quick. <laughs> oh, geez, the first person account. <laughs> That's so weird. His point of view, just uh, all my, yeah. He, if you see this video, you can see 
I wouldn't. No, I wasn't saying that. BFEP's saying that. So yeah. No, I'm not saying that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, no, not saying that. Collecting, I'm not saying that. <laughs> I see. I was just kidding. I'm just kidding to make you upset. I'm totally kidding. I'm not calling you that. <laughs> Let's see. Is it your light bulb? Uh, what's this sun? What's this? Sun? I feel bad a little bit. Have you watched Funny Brick's new video yet? No, I have not watched this new video. I'm sorry. It's BFAB's Instagram dead. Uh, so what? He is fat and not a supermodel. Yeah, no, no big deal. We might. We might be able to see him soon at uh, Philly, so that'll be awesome. And I still I'm a fat supermodel. I'm a fat supermodel. Wow. They call me thick. <laughs> they call me thick and jiggly. Bfab, can you try ASMR? Hello, people. I'm Bfab. <laughs> we got the gremlins in here, guys. <laughs> hey, this mind of mine is here. Welcome, thank you so much for coming, man. Appreciate it. I uh, know, but earlier when I was talking my barking animals to use the restroom, there was a light in the sky. And it's a UFO, man. It's a UFO. Uh, that is what he gets for false advertising himself. <laughs> yeah. Uh, your Instagram link uh, goes to your alternative page. Ooh. That's so weird. I don't know why. <laughs> that, that, that's kind of weird. I don't know. Maybe that's why my Instagram was dead. <laughs> my channel is dead too, but you know, I was happy at least like five people watched my top ten video. You know, <laughs> let's see. I'll probably be more because I took, you know, I took two days, no sleep. I scripted it at night, but I, I, I butchered something. I'm glad nobody, you know, caught on. I said Hirakuru, and the guy's name is Hikaru or Hikaru, or Hika. I don't even know, but I completely butchered the I name. Too. Even what? Haiku uh, is like a poem thing. So oh be. no, it's uh, some person from Exo Force, and I look at it and I'm like, why did I combine Marakuru from Arrow? Do you know what that is? <laughs> and uh, and that word H, so it's like um, Hirakuru. <laughs> like, wait, where did this come from? And I'm like, oh shoot, I hope nobody noticed. <laughs> <laughs> but when I scripted it, this was like a video that I actually scripted. And- <laughs> I'm like, where did I get this from? But I was reading it, didn't catch on it until after watching the video a couple times. I'm like, wait a second, who's Hirokuru? <laughs> so, oh, man. Uh, but I mean, people really like the video. I need to start replying to comments more, but I was way too tired to reply to anybody's <laughs> things. But, you know, people really like that I scripted the video. They're like, oh, this is probably your best video. Wow, it was really well put together. I'm like, yeah, I mean, I didn't sleep for two days. So it was like the two days I was off in a row. I just scripted the whole thing, wrote out every little thing. It's, you know, Jesse Good said he scripted everything. I'm like, oh, I'll <laughs> script it. it. took me about three hours to write a script. Yeah, I'm that slow. And do all this research. And then I had to take all the photos, put them on backgrounds, do this, do that. This was like, uh, you know, between two days, it's like a 14-hour project. So, wow. my hair wow. fell out. So, <laughs> I'm bold now. I'm dying. My hair is dying. Let's see. Let me forward that all. Uh, let me forward that to y'all. Thank you. Thank me later. How do you post links? Uh, you have to be a mod, I believe, to post links. See, good because I was about to show you guys that I was not uh, 300 pounds like the wannabe supermodel. <laughs> uh, no, um, collecting. We will never call a woman fat. <laughs> I might not, but <laughs> I don't know. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. I will be fat. <laughs> you should. Uh, should like the exorcist <laughs> Jeez. you need to be mpd <laughs> uh mods personal device mods personal device something like that uh one of these uh morbidly obese supermodels obese models make them best what oh my god just an average morbidly obese supermodel <laughs> Break by break, the link does not work. What it, it has to uh, hide keys. <laughs> what the heck? it says, server cannot be found. Break by brick. I think there is uh, obese models. Yes, there, that is actually true. There is a hi. I'm Piaton. I'm an obese model. Nice to meet you. <laughs> I'm a beast <laughs> supermodel. <laughs> I have fat on my sides, my legs, my eyes. <laughs> 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 I got more rolls than you have in years of experience. I got more rolls than a Rolex. So, 
<laughs> um, uh, let's see. I'm not gonna comment on that. Trivor, what they promote promote unhealthy living. Yes, exactly. Like doing that. That's ridiculous. Uh, let's see. The mob police department <laughs> OBV. Uh, or a spelling error. Either or. Yeah. Brick by brick me. Um, Trevor. True Trevor. That one should work. Uh, but so do the super skinny ones. Yeah, kind of. But you know, that's uh promoting like the healthier ish <laughs> let's see it did not uh mnr uh never mentioned me for helping him with the brick lane buster really did you uh help on anything like scripting or something like that i think most of his content was actually taken from uh bfab's uh video or stream yeah it might have been might as well been called bfab's live stream right <laughs> uh, it was a good video i was you know i was proud of what he you know did <laughs> I was proud of the the part that I played in there, hosting the stream to get the the uh, the stuff going, like uh, him uh, spreading his money, uh, like he he spread like four bucks or something. Like, <laughs> I thought uh, it was a funny live stream. That's why, I like, when you know, uh, like I said, I don't have any malice towards Brick Queen. I think she's cool, but like when you know when she tried to take me to tell me to take that out, like there's no way I'm taking it out the stream, you know. Yeah, yeah, that was a crazy stream. I did not expect a lot of things in there, and especially, especially like the cursing parts. That was crazy. Did not expect uh, like a Lego YouTuber like that to uh, swear, but <laughs> she was triggered from. Uh, actually, I think he uh, swore too. But um, yeah, there was just like a hectic little stream, and I got six bucks. So I wonder if Brick Queen <laughs> has anything to say about that. Money, 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 money. <laughs> oh, I, I just make it rain. really cool. The set usually goes for a hundred sealed, hundred plus sealed, and I got it for let's see, it was this plus tack. So I was forty three dollars, and I got it sealed in the bags. It's an older set, and I'm like so happy. So yeah, nice. That's awesome. I had to borrow money from my mother. I'm like, hey, mom, I'm broke, and she's like, oh, okay. So man, that is crazy. If I had a job like you, oh my god! I'm... Oh, they cut my hours though. At night, I'm only getting sixteen hours now. So I got a, a dramatic income hit. So I mean, before, yeah, it was really good. But going from thirty nine to sixteen at night, you know, then my other job, I work thirty. I'm not really prof making as you know a, a lot anymore. So I mean, I yeah. still have decent money. I'm not broke, you know. Well, I am broke at the second. But when I get paid next week, no, I'll still be broke. Oh, my mom's six, seven hundred dollars. But after that, I should be <laughs> safe. <laughs> um, I only work six hours out of the week, so I, I barely get anything. Well, you're also really smart, Brick World. So that's the thing, right? You're doing college stuff, and you know how to invest. You, you. I mean, for the most part, you know how to make profit if you want to. So that that's the thing. Me, I'm like, um, you know, I would start up a, a channel or I mean a store, you know, and buy stuff for the store if I could find really good deals. But I, I would probably never show up to the post office. And then, you know, all the people would be like, I didn't get my order. It's been five months. I'm like, I'll get it to you next week, you know? So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I got quite a few orders that I have to get ready tonight or not tonight, actually, tomorrow and then ship them out. I have finally butt shop. Uh, he uh, he paid for the the ultimate ultimate Batmobile, so that is finally going to be gone tomorrow. That took about what five years. Oh, no, but I'm just so happy to finally have it gone, and you know that's extra eighty seven dollars, I think. So you know that's that's extra money in my pocket, which is great. But you always give us good deals anyway, so you know I always appreciate that. Yeah, I don't know when the next time I'm going to have a good deal. <laughs> of course, we'll be trying to sell something. I'm charging a double because that last time I gave you a good deal, remember that? <laughs> no, it's it's okay. I only made $3 off of that. That's not too bad. I got my money back. Of it, so that's I, feel, yeah. I have the old uh, Death Star still, so once I go through that and uh, let you know that it's – or actually, no, you need instructions. I got screwed over with that Death Star so badly. <laughs> You know what, what place has instructions brick set? Yeah, I, I have uh, the PDF for the instructions, so I, I'll be using that. But uh, definitely the whole situation with it kind of like messed me up because I'm like down $400 with everything I got from that one um, haul. So $400. That's the thing is, Brick World, I've never seen you like seem like really, really, really frustrated. You seem pissed off. I'm like, you know, in that video. So I'm like, you. I personally would have just confronted the guy, you know, but that's just what I would have done. 
yeah, well, four hundred dollars, I guess, isn't that bad at the moment. But you know, that four hundred dollars I could have actually used for um my bills coming up. So I gotta try and come up with another four hundred dollars to pay for everything. But um, you can always rob a bank, you know, <laughs> or you could rob collecting bricks, you know. I guess that one's a little easier, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Like going back to uh, the uh, super obese model fronts, <laughs> just going to her house like, I'm going to catch you one of these days. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not uh, that uh, collecting makes that. I don't know. She's definitely, she's a, um, I don't know, a body. She works out. She works out quite a bit more than me actually right now. So <laughs> she probably destroyed herself. I don't even work out. The thing is, once I finally can pass my driver's test, because I had to wait like almost two months to retake the dang test, but it's booked all the way for months, which is crazy. Like, what are these kids like practicing driving, driving tests at eight in the morning? Like there wasn't even that available. So I'm like, dang, you know, and that's the only town. Like it goes, your things have been booked for the next 60 days. And then I was able to find one for October 15th. I'm like if I fail now, it's going to be like, get away by the time I'm driving, you know, but that better not happen. So. Yeah, I hope I uh, next time I'll just have a gun and like $500. I'll be like, oh my God. Don't do that. Don't just be a water gun. Be a good driver. Just, or just <laughs> well, you know what I'll do? I'll go like at 100 miles an hour, you know, and I'll be like, like stop, please. I'm a family. And they'll be like, no, you want me to be, you want, I'm like, uh, you want me to pass? No, you should say, have you ever watched Speed? And she's like, yes, yes, I've seen Speed. That's going to be the situation in this car, okay? I cannot go <laughs> under 60 miles per hour and I cannot stop. I'm just like, you know what? Today we're both going to die. So. <laughs> You're ready to die, brother. <laughs> and you know what? If I survive or you survive, if I survive, I get my license. If you survive, then I'm dead. And that, oh. you, you probably get to live. You'll probably be in a coma for the rest of your life. But hey, you know? Oh, man. <laughs> Uh, I should have brought money last time, you know, because like where I had to go is like in the middle of nowhere. It's some small like farming town and everybody is all like, hey, back in my day, you know, I used to eat hay, you know, but it's like, um, <laughs> it's like, you know, so it's it, everybody there is dressed like very like casual. Well, I came in there wearing like really expensive stuff. So they probably thought I was a really stuck up person. You know, because like where I live or like I don't live in a rich area, but where I work is a really rich area. So you dress really nice. So you fit in with the people there. So they don't look down and go like, oh, my goodness, you see you wearing this, you know, be the really judgmental. And so then when I go down to a town where nobody cares, people are like, oh, why is this kid wearing this and this and that? Don't you think he's better than us? You know, so. Yeah, that's weird. I live in a rich area, too, but um, oh, yeah, you just- totally do. Yeah. Brickworld has a mansion, so if you guys ever go homeless, let's camp out there. <laughs> no, we don't have mansions, but there's quite a lot of mansions nearby, and a lot of them are being built at the moment, too. So I do definitely live in a rich area, um, or zone, kind of. Like, right now, I live right next to the hood area, but, you know, the rich area is not too far. But I'm, I'm mainly around there uh, pretty much all of the time. So, um, And everyone's just like uh, normal, normal people. <laughs> They walk out with like normal clothes, like what exactly I'm wearing, sports stuff. Um, that's pretty much what everyone does uh, around my town, except for going professionally, like going to the jobs and such. But um, everyone's just uh, chill down here, except for Minnesota, I guess. Yeah, the well, Minnesota there. people, they, they always say Minnesotans are the nicest people, but they're so judgmental. They're like, oh, he's not wearing Calvin Klein. He's wearing Aeropasto. <laughs> We're going to have to call him out on that. Oh, my God. I hate it that there's like uh, so many different brands like that. And they're so expensive. Like Calvin Klein, I'm pretty sure that's one of the most expensive brands. Calvin Klein is, to be honest, like a higher middle. Like it's not really, really. Well, not not the most expensive, but. Yeah, you know, not like $50 or not $50. Uh, underwear, I'd say maybe 10 bucks maybe for underwear. One pair of underwear. Yeah, yeah, probably. Sometimes more. Jeez, oh, that's ridiculous. Well, I mean, as long as, long as you, you know, never mind. I will never spend that much. A lot of money on that for you know, but I'm not showing mm. it off. I'm not like running down the street. Hey, look at my Calvin Klein underwear. You know, I'm not mm. doing that. But my yeah. neighbors probably think I'm crazy right now, hearing me screaming. <laughs> They're like, "What are you talking about, Calvin Klein underwear?" Yeah, I totally would not do that. But uh, soon, I actually will have to be replacing 
pretty much my whole closet because of how much weight I've lost. Like pretty much all of my pants don't even fit anymore. I got to wear belts all the time and loop them like six things in or something to put my Go pants on. on Hot Topic, I mean, some of the pants are really expensive. But some, I mean, yeah, they're all really expensive. But they're really skinny, but they're also super stretchy. That's what I wear now. But I still, you know, I, if I lose weight, I'll still be able to fit in them. But they're stre- they're kind of like stretchy. So they, you know. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> it's also really weird looking pack. People are like, oh my goodness, why do you have zebra print on your pants? Are you okay? You know? Okay, I would not do anything like that. <laughs> like, well, I don't no, because like, you stick out. Like, literally, you have like people, women, you know, going up to me, like, oh my God, I love your pants. And you're like, oh, thank you, girl. You know, so. Yeah, that's exactly what the, the, the response would be because you're like, oh my God, I love your pants. I'm like, oh my god thank you girl like i appreciate that that's that's amazing like zebras i like zebras too What's I, I just like i just like wearing weird <laughs> stuff you know so it's like you know uh let's see josh the giraffe says why do people buy calvin klein just go to vf or something what's vf what? you know what vf is burke worlds i don't know i'm missing something welcome doc Simpson, by the way thank you so much for coming and uh welcome back to our lego studios uh, VF, uh, virtual force. No, it's not, uh, uh, brick 25 is also here. Thank you so much for coming. I'm sure he'll explain it here soon. VF. I don't know who said that. Who said VF? Or is it BF? Boyfriend? VF? That oh, would be yeah. boyfriend. <laughs> it was BF, but, uh, <laughs> I mean, unless he meant to type BF. Maybe. You can buy expensive underwear because you can. I'm not. Well, I'm not saying you can't, but it's like you know. Oh yeah, you're. Oh, I see what you're trying to say. You're saying you just buy it because you can. You don't really buy it for anything else. It's like there's all different styles and stuff, and it's like you know, unless I plan, you know, streaking, you know, down the street, you know, I don't care what brand I'm wearing. You know, I could be wearing, you know, boxers with like holes in it. You know, I I don't care. You know, I mean. Maybe other people care for other reasons, but I don't care. <laughs> Try to keep well, the stream as PG as possible. So yeah, I definitely would not do that. Like, uh, I, I do want to get you know different underwear because sometimes because of my pants, um, they don't fit, so they slouch down. And whenever I'm stretching, <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I, I know where you're going. <laughs> oh no, yeah, that's it. But I want to get different ones. Uh, I don't know, is it briefs? I don't know what I have. Like, uh, it's something else. You know, the man underwear kind the of. The Hanes? Hanes? I have Hanes. Uh, that's what I have. But uh, I think. <laughs> Let's call the underwear stream. <laughs> oh, I love this. People love I it. You have 15 viewers right now. So. <laughs> what underwear do you have? <laughs> oh, yeah, that'd be so weird. But yes, I, I have to get different underwear. I guess what I'm saying. <laughs> um. Uh, let's see about beef uh, when you say stuff like that. Uh, no, five for ten. Five for ten. Five. I need to check this out. I need to go on hot, not hot. I don't think hot topic sells boxers or underwear. I need to go on Aeropost, no, Abercrom, yeah, Hollister and check out their underwear. Yeah, there's like so many, but I think I'll just go to Walmart and pick up like a generic brand, but not the uh, not the ones I have on because Yeah, I'm gonna type this in the side chat. I don't know if you can see the side chat. Yeah, I can see it. Well, here we talking about Marty McFly. We were talking about him. <laughs> we're just talking about the brand, I guess. Uh are you done? John is here. Welcome. He's so much for coming. Why do people buy Calvin Klein? Uh just um just go for the uh, for something. Hey, work I just typed that in the side chat. That's the only reason why I just buy, you know, expensive, you know, like that. Well, if I know I'm going on a date, then I'll make sure I have something. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, <laughs> it's so weird. Uh, this is such a weird stream, but hey, people I, I like know. it. With the with the underwear I have, I'm not getting the dates. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's move. Let's move on from that. Um, uh, let's see. Oh my God, I love your pants. Last spot, but talk. Uh, you go, girl. <laughs> let's see. Oh, it's an outlet shop. Uh, VF an outlet shop. Don't know. Might be around you. Uh, I don't know. 
Uh, you buy expensive underwear because you can. Yeah, yeah. If you can, then definitely do it. But I don't. Uh, I wouldn't do that really because wasting like ten bucks on one pair of underwear is just kind of weird. It's actually twelve ninety five. I'm on Hollister right one, now. One pair. Yeah, one pair. Holy cow! Okay, they that's... do have a deal going on right now. If you buy three, you get two free. So it's a great deal. Take opportunity of this sale because the sale won't last long. Thirty eight dollars or wait, you said twelve ninety nine, right? Uh, twelve. Yeah, it's like from twelve ninety nine to you know. Let's see. Uh, yeah, let me make sure. So from twelve ninety five, they're usually oh, the okay. Average, so that's thirty nine then. Yeah, yeah. Three pairs, but but you get five out of it. Oh my god! But uh, for this limited opportunity only, you buy three and get two free. So sounds like a good marketing strategy. No, definitely not. Go to Old Navy. <laughs> they have like oh, does Old Navy own. still exist. Yeah, well, they're dying slowly. <laughs> slowly but surely. Let's see. They have it at malls and stuff. VF. I, I don't know what VF is, though. Uh, let's see. I'm I just type buy what the... VF is. Oh, you know? No, I'm oh. going to type it and see what it means. Oh, okay. Uh, VF Corporation. Oh, it's an American apparel and footwear company founded in 1899. Oh, my Dang. God. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what this is. <laughs> They still have cotton underwear. Back in my day, we never... No. That underwear is very itchy down under. <laughs> that doesn't sound right. <laughs> that doesn't sound right. Uh, let's see. Uh, so Collective Bricks says if we get underwear, we might be able to get a Liaf. Um. <laughs> Briefs are the regular uh, tidy whities yeah, I think uh, I think I should invest in some briefs, but some things are just way too tight. <laughs> like, like, suck it. <laughs> like, oh god, so sucky, sucky. <laughs> what? <laughs> that was. <laughs> I am so confused. <laughs> uh, and so, brick by brick, asked Collecti if that's what she looks for in a guy, and she said, "Not her," but you know. So I I guess so we don't have to take her advice on, because I don't know. He's trying to give women advice, but she's not taking the advice. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I'm getting at, but wooden bacon, no, it does not show. I'm not a plumber, so it would not show up. But um uh no, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about underwear. <laughs> this uh, is such a great stream. Michael Jordan wears, dude, I swear he he does wear Heinz. He's not a generic person. He's, he's a millionaire. He would not wear Heinz. He'd wear like Calvin Klein if Calvin Klein had a expensive child. I, I, Somebody um, said you look like their their teacher. Me? Yeah, Brick Girls. Are you a secret teacher by chance? Who said that? You look uh, Brick Seller. Brick Seller. I, I don't know. I might be. Somebody said I look like their art teacher. So I don't know what's going on with that. Like that was an insult to me, but I don't know. <laughs> oh my god. This is like years ago. They're like, well, you, fam, you look like my art teacher. And I'm oh like, what? God. Come on, Collector Rick. Don't say that. Uh, oh, okay. Just drop that. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I guess you made it worse for FIFA than that. <laughs> Uh, all right, so let's see. BW is a plumber. Plumber crack is real. I'm not a plumber. No, no, it's not real. Uh, let's see. I'm just joking, but seriously, BFAB is mean to me outside of the stream. Uh, well, good point. VF well, is. Well, here's the thing I'll start being nicer. Brickles, but you gotta take my place. I'm not gonna be mean. No. Well, here's the thing. Collective will say the most random things, so I have to respond in the meanest ways, you know? Like it'll be like three in the morning. So I'm like, ah, da, 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 da. and I'm like, okay, what do I respond? So I just say something mean. <laughs> or Dora says, "I'm a deity. I'm a deity. I don't know. You're already skinny enough. You don't have to diet." Um, <clears throat> people buy Calvin Klein because I, mean, I don't think that's what he means. He's a deity. I don't think he's saying it. <laughs> Two uh, different. It says deity. Like seriously, I think it's pronounced deity. Uh, deity was a, a Zeus a was god a deity. A goddess, who, okay. Yeah, yeah. He's a god. Yeah. Uh, I'm a god of goddess. That's yeah. I'm 
No one is dating your underwear. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. That's what this topic, this whole stream is about now. Just underwear. <laughs> Hey, but I'm still saying, guys, as a promotion, though Hollister does not sponsor this channel, buy three, get two free. Get on the deal. Use code BFAB and nothing will happen. So <laughs> That's a great diet, AWM. I see food, I eat it. Or I, I see food diet. I see food and I eat. <laughs> who's I'm, saying that? AWM. Okay, I was about to say, there's this really fat guy at my work who's like 400 pounds, and he always says that. When I offer him money to lose weight, he's like, oh, you know, I'm already on a diet. She food and I can't. And then, like, all his, like, chins are moving at the same time, like, in unison. It's, like, five chins. And I'm like, like, dang. Like, gills or something. <laughs> yeah. I'm literally, no, it's so unhealthy because he's always complaining about his back and his, his legs. I'm like, dude, I'm serious. Since I put on weight, I can feel it in my back and legs. I said, if you lose it, you will not be in pain. Oh, that's not true. My doctor said that's not true. And I'm like, you know, so I don't know. It's like, it's, I don't know what I'm trying to get at. But like, he uses that excuse all the time. You just want to, you know, punch him in the face a couple times. So, or I mean, one of those, you know, chins that, you know, just go up and down, you know? <laughs> I see. Is that what guys, girls look for in a guy? <laughs> collecting bricks. Jeez. Oh my goodness. Did you see Collecting Bricks' text message? Yeah, I am sorry. <laughs> asshole. Uh, I mean, nothing. Sorry. You guys heard nothing. You you heard gas. <laughs> Levy's in the same time period, but you uh, you not making fun of them. I don't know. I don't know all these brands. I I don't care. I only go to Target and Walmart pretty much. Because well, I don't... Brickles, when you go on a date, sir, I'm gonna have to give you some advice on you know what to wear. You gotta get all. To you gotta get to wear all Hollister. Oh my god! No, I'm not wearing anything like that. No, because then the women will think you're this rich person. Then you'll actually be working two jobs. Yeah. You know? <laughs> then I have to work two jobs. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, honey, where do you want to go out to eat tonight? <laughs> I won't be eating tonight. I already ate before. <laughs> <laughs> just, just sacrifice everything you own and just be like, you know, I don't know. But it, it, it's like I don't know if you if you come off as rich, I feel like women. You know, even if you're poor like me, if you come off as rich, women will be drawn to your you more. And there'll be a freaking gold digger. I don't want to deal with that. Okay, then this is what I need you to do. That if you want to do the full, you know, all nice stuff, I want you to literally take you know the the worst clothes you could find, roll in dirt, drill some holes in your shirt. You know, cut some holes in your shirt. And then, um, you know, just walk around like, hey, girl, give me a dollar and a date, you know, okay, see if that okay. works. So, like a social experiment, just going up like a homeless man. <gasps> Can you spare a dollar? And... Can I have your number? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so then put it on your channel and see what happens. Do um, watch yeah, the video, just get millions of views. You know that that might uh, that might happen, but I think I would go to a different city because I wouldn't want to be in my city too. I was like, "Hey, how you doing? I know you." And then I, just, I just come out as a businessman, like oh, I lost my wallet and I have a dollar, and they'll actually give me like ten bucks or something because I'm looking nice instead of being a homeless man. And then they'll say, "Can I have your number? You're so nice. I'm gonna pay it." Pay it back to you. And like, you, oh. you know you do. This always works. Just you know, take tear their ego down. So like you know, go up to a you know a female who thinks she's all pretty and stuff, and go, oh, what is that? And they should be like, what? And they're like, your face is disgusting. But oh if I got, God. hey, that works. Be you know, if they have coffee in their hand, they're gonna go. <laughs> <laughs> you give me a new coffee now. <laughs> they're just like, ew, look at that. And then she'll be like, all offended. Then you'll be like, what is that ugly on your face? And you're like, what? I'm ugly. I'm like, here, if you date me, I can afford your plastic surgery. And then you'll be oh all self Oh, my God. You go do that. I swear. If you do that, then, jeez. Oh, okay. that works out. I, I've oh. seen people say worse stuff, and it really works out usually. Oh, oh God, jeez. What time is it for you and BFAB? Uh, BFAB, it's 9.58. Or, sorry, 8.58. And it's for me, it's 9.58. Hi, you it's are late. correct. Let's see. 31... Five thirty-one dollars fifty cents. Four. You better watch his. Uh, what is that? Commercials? Is that commercials? I cannot read. Commercials. Yep. Mister Heinz is a ketchup uh, brand. Yep. Uh, 
Hanes is the, uh, the the underwear brand. I feel bad for plumbers. Luckily, I have seen any have not seen any in years. Plumbers make a lot of money, though. That's yeah. the thing, especially if you own your own business. You go to trade school to be a plumber. You're making a lot of money. Electricians, plumbers, diesel technicians, mechanics, all those you go to trade school for, you can make a lot of money. You know, my dad, you know, he, um, you know, is a diesel technician, makes pretty good money. Um, but I'm just saying, you can literally, electrician, plumber, you know, any of those jobs pay a lot of money. Hmm. Yeah, definitely. I wish I could do those, but um, I, I hate it. <laughs> I'd rather be a, um interrogator. Which I'm uh, looking to get my career going for that. <laughs> Got to be a counter. Brickworld, I think you'd be too nice to people, or we might see the evil side of you that like you we never knew you had. You know, just yeah, like I, the person like I will not talk. You just like take a baseball bat at them. Right, like, you're not gonna talk now. They're like, no, I will not talk. Then they just like come off like they're in a body bag. But like, Brickworld, what did you do to them? Oh, they, they wouldn't talk. I gave them three chances, three strikes, and you're out. <laughs> No, I'd be like, hey, you want to go surfing with your mouth? Yeah, I, I got some. <laughs> <laughs> the only adults would get that reference, okay? <laughs> I'm not going to say it. <laughs> oh, man. Let's see. Just without uh, the glasses. Okay, so I look like your teacher without the glasses. Hello, class. How's it going today? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> oh. Uh, evil brick worlds. Who's ready for a pop click? <laughs> oh, God. Pop, pop quiz and you punch him in the face. <laughs> <laughs> pop quiz. <laughs> you got around, Mr. Pow. You, you're broken. <laughs> then he goes to it. You were ugly enough. Whatever. Nobody cares. You don't want me wearing glasses? Well, I'm going to break your glasses, okay? <laughs> uh, a very bad joke. Come on, that was funny, Brick Sailor. Uh... <laughs> Can you take them off for me to see? <laughs> oh my god. Sorry, I'm so late to uh, read that, but I uh, got it done for you. Bfab is sarcastic, not mean. Oof, uh, wacky do. Uh, so not true, Bfab. You are the only, uh, the one that is always texting us. Although that's uh, not what that means, BW. <laughs> Don't listen to Bfab. Uh, you and me will. Uh, only uh, ever be able to understand our weirdness diet diety versus dieting <laughs> thank you brother <clears throat> he spelled it wrong though so that's why i said it that way uh, let me uh let me have it say this time deity 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 uh, i think so, he spelled it right no i just autocorrected it like it, it was spelled this other way deity oh now Apple comes up. Never mind. I can't do it. Uh, but yeah, it was deity, and then it's uh, instead of deity. Um, oh, okay. Oh, Brick Sailor. Okay, he's saying my joke was good. Or your joke. Well, you said the pop quiz joke, too, but he's saying the mouth joke was bad. I wasn't making a joke. <laughs> oh, he's serious. <laughs> Brick was serious. Okay. I wasn't trying to make a joke. I was just saying things, you know. Trying to act the part as a teacher. If you ever do anything illegal, you might not make it to the next day, especially with Brickworlds around. Though, this is what I'd do. Brickworlds would be like trying to interrogate me, like, hey, man, remember back in the day when we used to be on live streams together? Are you sure you want me to tell you the location of the Bob? <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. That uh, that information for back then is classified. Uh, and now uh, it's classified. My whole life is classified. And I'll be like, go step on a Lego brick, and you'll be like, triggered or whatever. <laughs> I, I know 25 anymore. different methods to torture you with Legos, okay? <laughs> <laughs> First, belly flop on Lego. Yeah. <laughs> Second, eat a Lego brick. Third, <laughs> okay, I give up the information. The bomb is <laughs> behind you. Oh, it was that whole time? Yep. <laughs> Find holes to fill with bricks. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, my God. I just had to because that was like the funny thing. <laughs> Oh man, could you imagine? That would be so painful. I, you know, here's the thing. I think if you get tortured enough with Lego bricks, you, you, you just probably get numb. But then in the past, where I've like, you know, stepped on a Lego brick, then all of a sudden kept stepping on it at night, you know, step on basically a whole side. You, you feel the pain, then your foot goes numb because you're in so much pain. You know, <laughs> like ah, oh, my foot. Okay, wow. Actually, I don't feel pain anymore. Um, I really want to try to beat that world record. So I know that guy, be, uh, I totally forgot his name. He beat it. 
and then he Lego beat it or some other company beat it. The Lego beat that company, but he did it again and beat them. So it's like I have a feeling this is gonna be like a never ending, you know, challenge. People are gonna be like, oh yeah, I can I'll see if I can, you know, injure my foot by walking a Legos to prove a point for a world record that's gonna make me look like an idiot, but okay. Yeah, it was dude perfect that uh, beat the the guy. I, I don't know why they did that because they it's not even like that's so stupid. Why would they do that? Like they just spent a lot of money on uh, buying all the Lego like that, and also uh, like trying to get Lego um, get its world record. Like that's so stupid. Just leave it to the Lego people. You don't need world records, jeez. Yeah, but then didn't he beat them again? He really did. Yes, yeah, he beat them again. Yeah, so it's like. You know, I, I mean, yeah, he's like probably like, I want to reclaim, I want to have my title, which is fine, but it's like, I would never, there's no way they say, oh, B-Fab, you got to try to beat a record for, you know, the longest time walked a Lego break. I'm like, no, <laughs> bye. You know, I ain't doing it. You know, if you think I'm going to do that, I ain't doing it. So I think you know, the first I'll, guy did it for charity though, too. Oh yeah. Yep. He did it the first time it was for charity. Yeah. Which is fine, but there's no way, and I'm not trying to be jerk. But the guy is very heavy. So he had it worse than a lot of the other people. But he's heavy set. So with more force, you're putting more pressure on your foot. So <laughs> yeah. to be honest, he did it way better than the others. Just because of his weight, you know? Yeah. Jeez. Uh, I think I'm hearing the same thing as collecting uh, sister language. I just Hey, Jigglepuff is here. Welcome me so much for coming, Jigglepuff. Uh, I just came on uh, to like, but I'm watching Paranormal Activity. <laughs> okay, I thought I'm watching Paranormal Activity. I was actually thinking about watching Poltergeist uh, too today or tonight, but um. You act demon possessed if you watch that. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll see if we can watch it tomorrow because <clears throat> oh my god, was one of us. But yeah, I, I like the first Poltergeist. I think that was pretty interesting. Uh, but yeah, it's it's really crazy. <laughs> Yeah, I, I here's the thing. I remember the first horror movie I watched. People are getting scary. You're gonna be scared, and everybody's like freaking out. I think I was at a, a mental facility, so, so it was like a group me. Oh, we're all gonna go to theater today. I'm like, yeah, yay, woohoo! And then, um, you know, everybody's like freaking out, getting scared. I'm just standing there watching this, like, wow, this is such good editing. I wonder what you know what they did for this effect or whatever. I'm like, why is it this guy dies first? You know, so. Black guy always dies first. <laughs> and that was true. I'm like, oh my gosh, he got crushed in a locker. It was called the Lazarus effect or something. Lazarus effect. It's kind of like the butterfly effect. Like, uh, there's a game about the butterfly effect. Uh, I don't know if it's called the butterfly effect, but um, it was like uh, your actions can cause consequences and such. But then there was also a final destiny. That's kind of like uh, what you were talking about, being crushed in a uh, locker by a locker. Final Destiny stuff has horrible CGI, and uh, it's just like really disgusting watching that stuff with uh, the gore and such. The one that I can never get out of my mind is when the guy was inside a pool with uh, the pool pump and such. That was just disgusting. It sucked his stuff. You know what? Uh, welcome, Red Brick Studios. Thank you so much for coming. Red uh, Rebo Bricks, welcome back. Uh, let's see, BFAB, is that uh, is the one that you called me that uh, why are you getting me in trouble? <laughs> AWM. Uh, let's see. BFAB, search up Bongo Cat. Me. Um, I hit 1K. O O M L. All my life or something. Adore. Uh, congrats, man. That is really awesome. Uh, glad that you were able to reach 1K. Uh, and tonight, too. That's really cool. Uh, if BFAB jumped off your bridge, uh, would you do it? Would you do it, too? Uh, okay. I wasn't reading the full. <laughs> Uh, you have 18 viewers, so your stream's going up and down, but this is really good. You have a. I should not have mentioned the Final Destiny stuff. Sorry, guys. Uh, put that out of your mind. Uh, let's talk about something new. <laughs> let's see. Well, I'm saying your stream is actually doing really well right now, so that's like super good. Though Josh the Giraffe said he's going to leave and listen to music. Who do you think you are, bro? Listen to music? What is this? You're going to be like rocking some Justin Bieber, like baby, baby, baby. Oh. Yeah. Is that. <laughs> My yeah, neighbors awesome. literally can hear me, and they're probably like, oh, my goodness, what is wrong? Do we need to call the police or something, you know? He's talking about babies over there. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> but, like, does he want a kid? Oh, Rebo, you're in Cali. That's awesome, man. I, I wish it was 6.59 for me. <laughs> yes, I know. I wish I wouldn't have slept the whole day, so. You're lucky, man. I slept for, like, two hours after I got back from school. I was, like, so exhausted. 
Well, for like, okay, so what is today? Sunday? So Friday and Saturday. Monday. No, Monday. <laughs> That's what I meant. Saturday and Sunday, I worked at both jobs, I think. No, no, I didn't. Saturday, I worked at one job. Sunday, I worked at both jobs. So just because I haven't been doing that for a while, I was tired. So, you know, then I cleaned and I'm just like, screw it. I'm falling asleep. And I fell asleep the whole time and I didn't wake up. I, I just stayed dead. So <laughs> then all of a sudden somebody texted me beyond the grave. And yeah, then I'm like, <laughs> I saw a collecting message. I'm like, oh, no, Satan's back. So, you know, then then I, you know, so that's kind of, you know, what happened. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, so I'm finally up to the point of BW's teacher impersonate impersonation. <laughs> oh my god! Just so you know, you have 20 people watching right now. 20. Hey, glad that we have 20 people here. That is awesome. Let's have a good um, conversation to start. So, what else should we do, go with? Uh, we had underwear. Um, <laughs> what should we branch <laughs> out? Socks. How about socks? Socks, they get ruined so quickly. Well, I'm here's the thing about socks is I don't even wash them. So, oh my god, that is so <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> <Just kidding> around. <laughs> uh, but have you ever been like late for work or somewhere? And you're like, you know, what? I gotta wear these socks, and so you just take a bunch of axe and you just spray it on the socks, and you're like, you know, that that happens to me. But hey, it works. So that's why, like, axe, like you'll walk in a room and people's eyes will start wide, like, ah, my eyes, ah! you know. So it's like, you know. That's that always works. So uh, a tip: if you you don't have any clean socks, use Axe. That always works. Okay. Oh then the women will totally fall for you. They're like, "Oh my goodness, he's wearing Axe. What a cheap out!" But at least they'll love your smell. So, <laughs> like, no, I, it always happens. Like, I'll be working, and all of a sudden, the old person will come up to me and be like, "You smell so good." I'm like, I was about to say, "Why are you sniffing me in the first place?" You know? <laughs> oh man. See, I ate a legal brick one, uh, brick one. It it toyed in my throat, hit hit it, and it went it to. Oh my, I don't know what's up with the grammar there, but you ate a legal brick. Interesting. Hopefully, you spat it out right after. Uh, dude, perfect did it, uh, and then legal beat it. Yeah, and then uh, the guy took it back. So that's awesome. So great stream, <laughs> you brick twenty five. Can you teach us about Lego, Mister BW? Uh, Lego was created by someone in Denmark, and uh, he just branched off from there, and uh, now it's a billion-dollar company, or a multi-billion-dollar company, probably. Uh, let's see. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, left. No problem, man. Thank you so much for coming back. Uh, let's see. Teach. Will you do Lego class? No, I won't do Lego class. I'm a great teacher. This is why I totally, you know, I just want to say, guys, one plus one is two. So, yeah. I don't, like, I would never be a teacher like that. I, I don't know what I would do because I, I would just run off of a book because I I seriously am always stuck when trying to teach, like, kids what to do, what, what they're no, I feel like the teachers do yeah. use brick, books, Brick World. I don't think they're just, like, randomly just sit there and go, hmm, today we're going to teach you this, you know? Well, they do have to pull out their own uh, questions and such for assignments uh, and also quizzes and such. So that's what they do a lot of the time. But, um, you know, they have like the same thing that they do over and over again, uh, pretty much with uh, some of the classes. Like for college, they have that. They just do that. But then for like elementary school uh, teachers, they have to come up with uh, new themes every single week. Like, um, can you uh, can you draw this picture or something like that? Uh, you know, it's, it's always. What always school something. has drawing? Well, I mean, obviously, like they have one art class. But I, I mean, other than that, you know, I don't know. Um. <clears throat> well, I guess. Uh, kind Marcos, of like don't that. tell me you have to draw pictures for your classes. Not my, no, I, not my class. No. Okay, I was about to say if that's I, true, that hey, I'll go to school. I said what? elementary school. I said elementary school. <laughs> and I'm just kidding. Tell me how to draw a turtle. You like you all submit your photo of the turtles. Is that a turtle? Or is that my teacher? Were you were you trying to draw <laughs> me? You know. Oh my god, <laughs> that'll be funny though. Like a a, tur a um, the teacher's face on the turtle. Oh, that that actually be hot, you know. Uh, you I'm know, I might actually <laughs> I might actually try to crop one of my teachers' face on a turtle. See what happens. I'm gonna go listen to music. See you guys. Thank you so much for coming, Josh. Uh, have fun listening to music. Uh, listen to Brick Weeds. I, I think I'm scaring off your viewers, Brick Worlds. No, it's okay. We're at 13 viewers, or we're getting out, getting down there. But it's 10:13, so we're probably gonna have to go to sleep here soon. Um, what 
Oh my god. Uh, I am in Arizona. Oh, so yeah. Yeah. Time zone. Sorry. Uh, I don't. I don't know why I assumed your state. I'm sorry. Arizona, California. Um, I think New Mexico is not in that time zone. Possibly uh, Washington. You know, there's quite a few, I guess. But it's so weird that there's actually just four states on the east or west coast, and there's like um, more than thirteen, you know, on the east coast for the um, yeah, the east coast of the United States. So it's very weird like that. But actually, um, I, I thought I heard something about uh, California like, going to be eventually splitting up into four states. Hasn't that been mentioned for like years now, and they haven't done anything about that? Yeah, I thought uh, recently, like a few months ago or something, they brought that back up. So uh, I don't know if it's going to happen, but you know that would be pretty interesting if we have four other, or, uh, three other states, I guess, in a way, uh, in the United States. So that would make fifty-three states, which is a odd number. So why would why would we ever want to do that? We should just uh, conquer Europe and just have them as states. <laughs> uh, you know what I think I should do? I should just move to England. I don't know why. I think that's my uh, goal. If you can't drive on uh, America's roads, I don't think you should go to England. <laughs> uh, I'll just like Uber exactly. everywhere. I'll be like, hey, Mike, can I get an Uber? Uh, I don't know if that sounds British, but, you know. <laughs> it's like Australian mixed with uh, the, the British accent. Okay, let me try something Hello, different. Hello, good day. How you doing? Uh, I love Australian people, so I'm a little biased. So you know, like every time, like I'll go to work and I'll be like working uh, my day job, and there's like only like a bunch of Australian people that are super rich, and I'm like, they're like, hello. I'm like, hello. I don't say that, but I, you know, I, I'm, and they're like, can I have this, please? And then they say like, please after everything, which is awesome. I find it hilarious. There's two people. Not saying they all say that, but like, uh. There's these two different people that always, like, every time I'm grabbing something else for them, they're like, can I have this, please? Can I have this, please? Can I have this, please? And then they spent, like, $300 in the little deli case. You're like, how do you spend $300 on that every time I see you, you know? Oh, my God. That's crazy. They're kind of rich, so they're balling, shot yeah. calling. No wonder $300 spending. Jeez. Character socks, yes or no? Uh, I guess, like, a, as a collector's item, probably for some of the character socks. Like, you know, the Star Wars stuff. Uh, I think they came in, like, their own little case or something for Star Wars. I think those are pretty cool. But um, I no, I would not wear character socks. Um, I would show – I would wear socks that have my face on it, you know. Okay. I think that would be kind of cool. Probably greatly disordered. You know, also, you know, I, I, I should start doing that, selling socks with my face on it as merch to see if anybody buys any. I'm like, ah, it's a demon. <laughs> Like pray over the socks now. Um, let's see, thanks for the knowledge, Bfab. Getting my pizza now. Ooh, you're getting pizza. Nice. I want some food right now. I don't know. Should I make a sandwich? Rick World's eating food is wrong. Now just get drink a smoothie. No, I'm just kidding. I don't have smoothie material. You don't have I smoothie don't... material. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't have anything that can make a smoothie. Oh, I thought okay. That's not like you were saying, like to like a girl. She'd be like, "What type of you?" Like you go up to her, and you're like, "I'm not smoothie material." <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> that, that'd be like so weird but funny. Well, here's the thing. You know what I do? Which I I did this last week. I borrowed more money from my mother. That's why I'm gonna be homeless in a box. Inside the box, I'm gonna be living with Lego sets. But I'm like, "Hey, Bob, can you buy me some protein uh, shakes?" And she's like, "Okay." So she brought me this vegan protein shake that's really good so though i'm out of <laughs> almond milk now so I, I can't even drink it now so i don't know how you guys can drink almond milk my grandparents it's so drink almond good milk. have you tried it no it's just like, so weird why would you drink milk from you nuts? will like it it's so good dude you'll feel like you're in heaven other than drinking from a cow's udder like if you want to do that have fun with that but i don't you want to drink from a cow's from udder nuts what you're drinking from nuts? That's so weird. <laughs> I'm drinking from almonds. You're drinking from under a cow. That's like, might as well go under the cow. And be like, give me your milk. You know, it's like, <laughs> yeah, it's just like, hey, Mr. Cow, do you have any milk for me today? Yeah, sure. Get on over there. <laughs> no, he's like, stop. Give me back my milk. Why are you stealing my milk, please? No, I said no. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you grab the right one, sonny. <laughs> I'm like that's for my baby cow. Stop taking that. Oh. You know, 
<laughs> oh man, uh, I cannot look at your face. It look, it look ten out of ten like my teacher. Oh my god, you gotta send me like a photo of what your teacher <laughs> looks like. I don't believe that. I see that. That'd be like a clone brick world. Yeah, like uh, you're you're supposed to have a doppelganger, doppelganger, I guess, but um. There's always like someone, you know, the, the opposite sex that is supposed to look exactly like you. So I wonder if there's I hope a- nobody of the opposite sex looks like me. That that person well, will be bullied for the rest of their life. <laughs> could you imagine me looking as a female? So. I'm sorry, Brooke Roll, that ain't happening. <laughs> yeah, you I have a female. Was- like I couldn't picture myself as a female. If that okay, if I was a female, which I I didn't say it was beautiful, but if I was a female, that female would be bullied all the time. Like, and I'd help bully the person because, like, if you look oh my, like oh that, my. you know, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I don't, don't you bully. look ugly. Like you look exactly the <laughs> <laughs> We're perfect for together. For, for together. <laughs> I'm like, you know, you want makeup? I'm like, here's some makeup. So, oh my you know. god. Hey, <laughs> I mean, if I could wear makeup, I totally would. I mean, I could, but you know, it, it you know, I, I think I'd look too good. All the way would be like, oh my goodness, is that Bone Quisha the seventh? You know, so. Oh god. Uh, let's see, you caught you caught me. I'm a master of laziness. Yo, Emola, em- what? Uh, let's see. They always say stuff like splitting up, but they never do anything. Uh, yeah, California. <laughs> England is my city. Eating pizza and driving. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. I've never actually eaten anything while driving. I've only drank water while driving. That's the only thing I've ever done. I'm going to try that. I try, Well, actually, here's the thing. I was driving with my mother because obviously I can't drive without anybody else. That's so embarrassing. But I was driving and eating a bar, and I almost, like, crashed. I, mean, I, I looked down for a second to eat a bar. Like, oh, watch out. You're about to go through the night. I'm like, oh, okay, I'm going to die. But now I've I become better at driving, so now I can actually eat while driving. So I'm the pro eater driver. So. Yeah, I seriously have never done that. Actually, I've never gone through a um, fast food drive or drive through um, to get food. Like, I've never done that. I've only parked and gone inside. That's what well, I actually do. like looking the people in the eye and be like, I like a Mick. Yeah. Mick well, pick something, Mick. I don't know. Everything Mickey. <laughs> Mickey. It's not Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> not Mickey I Mouse. Like I would like a Mickey Mouse, Mouse on my sandwich. I like. Um, <laughs> What what is it? Um, McNugget? I don't know. Yeah, it's McNugget. <laughs> I'm collecting Mr. Trust and B. Fab has to take his mom on dates when he since he only has his permit. That would be kind of weird, like a three wheeler, a third wheel. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, let's yeah, see. That's welcome. What... Sorry. Welcome to Lego Board Bros. Stop motion. Go ahead. Okay, uh, but yeah, I've never gone through a drive-through um, to get food like that. Uh, I, I don't know. I'll try to do it somewhat someday, but I don't know. I, I just feel weird doing it somewhat. Um, but I've only really gone to Wendy's, you know, drive. Are you worried that somebody's gonna pop out and like rob you or something? Work with like, hey, oh, like, I, I don't. I don't know. I just feel weird doing that for some reason. Like, it's just not me. Like I'm always in the other seat <laughs> when my parents are just trying to get food like that. So I don't know. Someday. Let's see. You so know, yeah, you know, I mean, I, I guess you just want to walk in because you want to talk to the pretty ladies, right? I don't know. Most of the time, those that uh, work at um, fast food restaurants like that, um, because they stick, stick around the oil so much, they have a lot of zits and such. So they look. They look. <laughs> That's why you got that makeup, though. Yeah, you know, what, what, what happened when you take the makeup off? There's a lot of zits. Like, yeah, you can play connect the dots for that. You, you still know? love me. <laughs> <laughs> like dang look at her and then also you like the makeup goes off oh my goodness am i playing connect the dots with myself or <laughs> oh my god <laughs> just be like wait a second can you stand right here just like take a little like marker or sharpie to start connecting the dots you're like oh my goodness it forms a photo <laughs> is that justin bieber <laughs> oh my god what, what is it called constellations, <laughs> constellations. <laughs> In your face, <laughs> oh, it's be like so, that's what you'd be so triggered. I'm like, big I have up there, okay? <laughs> so you'd be like, I have acne, I'm triggered. How dare you speak bad about the acne lovers of the world? 
I got acne too, but it, I have a little, but it, it's very, it's not visible. And the thing is, because I use the the face mud thing that women use, <laughs> because it's actually really good for you. It pulls like the the impurities off your skin, and it like dries, it dries out, then it pulls like like everything out. So it's not, um, it's it's actually really helpful if you're trying to have like really smooth skin, which I really. Yeah. I got something like that. I don't know what it's exactly called. It's it's probably not what you're talking about. It's just like something that you just rub on uh, on your face and such. It's supposed to help, I guess. Uh, it kind of helps. I, I use it every now and again whenever I have a huge breakout. But most of the breakouts, is just, I guess, on my chest and my back because um, whenever I sweat, uh, it goes in my shirt and such. So that's how it, it's being caused. Well, yeah, and I mean, here's the thing. I have very little acne. Like, you couldn't even really see it. Like, if you see me from, like, 10 miles away, you won't see it. But, um, you know, like, the the thing is that, like I said, the mud really does work. That It's like beauty mud or something. And it just it, it makes your skin look so flawless and smooth. Though, the beauty mud I bought, it was like, uh, what brand is it? I think I can have it right to the next side of my bed. Let's see. I move some garbage out of the way and then I clean my room, but it's still a little, uh, oh, there it is. It's called Pure Clay, one second, <laughs> it's like right on the floor. Okay, so it's called Pure Clay Mask L'Oreal Paris, so it's a girl's thing, but we're girls, you have sisters, you probably know about this stuff. Not exactly, I don't pay attention to everything that they use, like, but ah, what is that? <laughs> Yeah, I have something like feminine, like because you know that's that's what women usually use. There's like nothing really for men, but uh, it helps with acne for anyone. Yeah, I mean, here's the thing: I don't mind. Okay, this sounds weird, but I don't mind using women products if it makes you look Just better. Like, like, I'm not gonna all of a sudden start wearing you know makeup. I mean, even though I look really good doing it, but you know, I'm not gonna start doing that. But he will be like, "Hey." Beef app, did you get plastic surgery? Because your skin is smooth like cocoa butter, you know. And I'm like, well, I'm using this foundation that I got from this place, you know. So, oh, I see God. these eyelashes, they're fake. I just glued them in my eyes, and when I pull them out, I rip off part of my eye, you know. <laughs> so, All what right. people go to for beauty, you know. So we finally made it to the omelet, uh, omelet uh, conversation. So omelet milk is great. Omelet milk is amazing. Try it. Okay, good. Thanks. Omelets don't have nipples, though. <laughs> uh, let's see. They BW, I think they do. <laughs> BW, you would uh, be pretty girl. You would be pretty girl. <laughs> great. Aww. You know what? Well, you know what you could do. You could dress up as a girl and then ask collecting breaks out. See how that works out for you. What are you trying to say? <laughs> you said you'd be a pretty girl, right? Pork collecting bricks. <laughs> Being bored Did she say that? She said that, but she didn't say, oh my God, I'll date you if you're a girl. That's not what she said. <laughs> oh, okay. You know, you can do the dress of another that just like hang out with collecting bricks the whole time. And every time you just be like, girl, you know, you gotta, you gotta act more feminine about it. Ooh, a Japanese billionaire is announced to be SpaceX first. <laughs> Japanese what? A Japanese billionaire. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think I said? I, I literally thought you said this here. I don't know if you I, I can't <laughs> Okay. Um, Something bad then. Uh, oh, 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 here. I'll message you this. I don't know if I even spelled it right. So here. <laughs> what you said. I literally what? thought. I thought I hey, thought, Japanese. <laughs> I literally <laughs> thought. Let's go in space. <laughs> Uh, oh, yeah. I literally thought that's what you said. No, I did not say that. Uh, Lego Bros, uh, I'll check out the giveaway um, and see if it's worthy of me entering. <laughs> Burgo's like, it's not worthy of me. It's only a ten dollar set. <laughs> Let's see. Oh no, it's not worthy. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> I already got that set, and I hate it. <laughs> but what? Dang, that's brutal, man. He's trying to give it away, so he hates it too. Okay. Fair point. What set is it? Uh, it's a Zane polybag set the uh, from the Lego movie. It's the uh, Zane. Oh, I say? Yep. You hate that? I have like 50 of that set just sitting. It's not 50. It's about like 8 of them because I'm like, let me buy these for future giveaways. And I already just set out one that I built one. And I have like 6 more. I think I think I had a total of 8. So I think I have like 6 more right now. So Almond juice is not milk. Ooh, Doc says it's not milk. Do you think it's milk? I think it is milk. I mean, you're you're milking the almond. 
<laughs> Y'all stealing have, the almonds meal. Like Katya Brick said, they don't have nipples, so you're not milking them. You're just squishing them until they're they bleed the milk. <laughs> oh, that doesn't. I feel bad for the almonds now. Maybe I'll just like stop eating in general. <laughs> <laughs> what is uh? What is what is the next stage after being a vegan? <laughs> just not, not eating whatsoever anymore. Just, just dying three days later. Just uh, just um, what's it called uh, meditating. Just meditating. Be, uh, yeah, go up into the um, the mountains or something like that. Uh, wherever the uh, people are. God, I forget what their name is now. You know what I'm talking about. The, uh, yeah, the yeah. guys that have bald head ish right there. Uh, monks or Buddhists? Monks. Or, yes, yeah. Buddhist monks. Yep. Yeah, uh, I cannot think. <laughs> uh, ooh, what did she say about BFAB? Um, BFAB has to take his mom with him. Oh, we already talked about that. Didn't I? You're caught up with the chat. I'm not. I'm trying to get there. I feel weird going inside to order food. You feel weird doing that. I feel weird going through a drive through I don't know why. I like uh, one McNuggets, please. Grandma needs her chicken nugget. Oh my god! I watched this show the other day, which you you know you um you always hear the jokes about uh when someone asks order in the or says order in the court like I like one number five <laughs> extra shake or something like that. I just watched this uh, show and it was just like doing the same thing. It was so funny. I forget where it was exactly, but it's just ridiculous. People acting stupid like that, or you know, it's a TV show, so they're just following the lines. Um, see, I feel weird going inside. Okay, uh, hey, don't eat my chocolate chip cookies. Hello, all the teenagers are triggered. I have acne, and I love it. Beef up can suck an egg. Up. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, let's see. Beauty tips with Beef to Have. He is uh, the next beauty guru. guru. Uh, thank you, girl. Oh, I appreciate it. Oh, yeah. BFAB does my makeup by, oh, I'll see a brick boy builder. I'll uh, see, hello, if oh, if you got to look at uh, what you are eating, you need to learn to eat first. To eat first, law. What? I don't, I'm lost in that conversation or that message. Almost they, almost they took so long, but I'm almost done, but it's late already. I'm missing something with these guys. Uh, Brick Boy, just go to the giveaway. This is why I'm not going to be you guys' roommate for Brick Fair because it's Brick, uh, it's Philly Brick Fest, not Brick Fair. Unless you're going to Brick Fair as well. Because you guys would steal all my beauty products. Not me. Just be I mean, I might. It depends. But you probably have that cheap stuff. <laughs> that Walmart brand stuff. Hey, I got this from Walmart. You know, so... Oh my god, I'd take you on a date, BW, but only if you dress like a girl. Oh I think I think you can accept the offer. I mean, if you can if you can get us a, a four, right? Take it, you know. Can get a four? Are you calling her a four? <laughs> or I look like a four. If no, I get a four. I'm not calling you a four girl. I'm saying if I was a girl, was a I'd look like a four. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding around. Oh my god. Uh no, I'm just kidding, Brooklyn. You probably don't want to do that, you know? I'm not going to dress up like a girl. <laughs> That's not going to happen. So when do you think the space plane will be done? I don't know. Yeah, the Japanese billionaire wasting money. Yeah, how much is he spending on that? Like, seriously. Okay, well, now i got to go. Bye. See you, Brick Builder. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, almond juice, soy juice, not milk. Bye. Uh, what if BFAB was a girl? BW. That'd be really weird. He definitely acts like a girl quite a bit <laughs> with his beauty products and then uh, his uh, feminine voice that is actually really spot on. I know. I mean, it's so spot on. <laughs> well, I guess transgender. <laughs> now I'm sounding a little transgender, but I mean, here's the thing. That's the exactly. Of, oh, my God. I mean, <laughs> it's like, I don't know. It's weird. It's really weird. Oh, my God. We're, oh, we're going right down to Electric Avenue. <laughs> and then we take it higher. <laughs> and then we take it higher. <laughs> we got the uh, the song going on in the uh, the chat now. Out on the streets. Uh, what's the show name? I I don't know. Actually, I think it was a cartoon. I think it was called Paradise PD. Uh, let's see. Paradise PD? Why does that sound familiar to me? Is that a cartoon? Like an yeah. animated thing? Yeah, animated on, um, on Netflix. I think I saw it a while 
back. It, it's pretty disgusting. Like, uh, it, it, if you've ever heard of, um, uh, is it kind of like Archer? I think I've seen it before. Not, not really that much. Uh, it's it's based off of Brickleberry. Um, it's like a it's an old TV show. Um, that wait, Paradise PD. I think I just watched this. Wait a second. Does it have that fat police cop in there? Yes. I just started watching this a couple days ago. Yeah, I started watching it too. Like, um, I'm not really into it that much. It's just really freaky and such. But um, you know, like uh, I'm just watching it for. Yeah, you know. I, here's the thing. I watched a couple episodes because Netflix keeps promoting it. Like for a while, the you know, it'd pop up on the little commercial thing. So I would say, let's see what episode I'm on for that. But it's it, it was okay. I mean, I'm not like the biggest fan of it. I'm on season one, episode eight. And I didn't finish it. I'm like almost done with it. I'm on like the fifth episode or something. But how I uh, found out about it was like Netflix. I'm uh, subscribed to Netflix on YouTube. So I got a, the subscription. Uh, it was in the subscription box about um, like a uh, 911 call, you know, a fake 911 call about uh, this one guy that got his dawn stuck in the uh, the shredder. <laughs> I want to keep this up. <laughs> and I said dawn, but he said dawn too. But that was just crazy i thought it was actually 911 calls but then it turns out it's just a cartoon it wasn't <laughs> it wasn't about that one call well, it's, calls. Not, it's not horrible it's just weird you know it's like really weird you know it you know what cartoon that i really like that's funny and good is archer like archer's a, you know very good animated i mean there's serious stuff too but it's also really weird right yeah. so you know that I I liked it. I mean, it's not it's not horrible. I mean, I would have watched it if I really liked it. Right now, watching BoJack Horseman season five. Um, I don't know why I like that show. It's so weird, but I keep watching it. Yeah, I'm um, never gonna start watching that because I might get somewhat into it because I always want to finish off the series and such like that. But the other show that I was thinking about was Mr. Pickles, and that show is horrible. Like, oh my god, so disgusting. I, I I've never heard about that. Is that also a Netflix thing? No, it's uh like there's the whole um full episodes and such is on uh YouTube, so you can look up uh, Mr. Pickles. It's about like a demon dog. It's ridiculous. Oh, that's weird. You know what I just got today? I just got Hulu today, and I love Hulu. I got Hulu too, but uh, I don't have it on my phone anymore. <laughs> I wish I had it on my phone. Well, I have it for this reason because it literally has a lot of stuff Netflix doesn't have. So, like the combination between Hulu and Netflix, I'm set. So I'm really happy with that. So yeah, I have a uh, I have Hulu, Netflix, and Amazon Prime uh, Video. So I like watching all those. Ooh, what is this? The first? What was the first? Yeah, there's uh, some interesting shows that uh, that you don't find on uh, Netflix and such like that. Um, so are you on Prime or are you on Hulu right now? I'm on Hulu. Yeah, I was. Well, here's the thing: like they have a bunch of TV shows. Which somebody was telling me this. A lot of the TV shows they have, once they're released, immediately they show up on there, or like a day later. Yeah, which I didn't know. That. So I, I like that concept. I do have like cable already, but I don't want to, like, you know. Have to walk downstairs and go and look, you know, on the TV. And, oh yeah, look at this, that, or whatever. But um, I, I like the concept of that. And then also, it has Family Guy and Simpsons because Netflix got rid of Family Guy and Simpsons, and they have all the seasons and all the episodes on Hulu. Oh, you know that. Yeah, so that. Hulu has Attack on Titan, and I haven't finished the season two. You got to finish that. But Netflix has uh, season one. Hopefully of they, what? Uh, of Attack on Titan. Oh, okay. I don't know what that is. Oh, I do know what that is. I made a video on it about Lego thing, which was fake. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind. Right, let's see. Your friend is... Uh, I cannot read tonight. I'm so sorry. What is that? Correcting. Correcting. Oh, my God. Uh, let's see. Just remember one thing. I was just horrified uh, the other day. Oh, sorry. Very horrified. The Mr. Pickles thing. I'm not just horrified. By it's just ridiculous. You can never unsee something. Yeah, definitely. Uh, and I think Doc is right. True Doc. Archer is sweet. Just got done the newest season. You know, I want to try and watch that. Um, my dad, he's into that. He he likes watching Archer. I You'll love that. Archer. Archer is like wacky, mysterious, weird at the same time. Yeah, I don't think it's as bad as uh, Mr. Pickle, but I've never just gotten like into it. But uh, I've 
watch some episodes with my dad when he puts it on. The well, when it was on Netflix, I should check if it's on Hulu because it only had up to season six. And I think they're on the season eight, season nine now. And so once I was watching it, I got really into it. And then all of a sudden Netflix took it away and usually they'll renew season stuff, you know, um, but they didn't. And so it, it was the first like three episodes. I couldn't stand it, but I just kept watching it. But I'd watch like everything on Netflix mm. um, that I wanted to. And then all of a sudden, I just kept, I kept watching it and watching it. Then I got into it. It was became one of my favorite shows. So, yeah, Archer is no longer on uh, Netflix. Uh, they replaced it with like Pacific Heat, their own little runoff of it. Yeah, I watched that. I watched the full seasons of that too. It was okay. It wasn't, you know, it kind of had the Archer vibe to it, but it wasn't the same. Oh, um, it's not. Uh, Archer's not on Prime, so that stinks. Can't watch it there. Darn. Oh, see ya, um, uh, Collector Mix. Thank you so much for coming. Have a good night as well. Collector Mix doesn't want to join our evil call. Collector, if you want to join the post show, we'll probably go to the post show here momentarily. Possessed by the devil. Anyone watching? Uh, what the heck is that? He's just angry that she's a four, so she's trying to leave, you know? Disenchantment. I don't know what disenchantment is. Enchantment. <laughs> Sorry, um, let me try to but yeah, it's like uh, the dog's possessed or the dog's the devil. I don't know. It's so freaking weird. Don't watch it. <laughs> Be fair, beyond and put her to sleep. Yeah, put her to sleep. She was doing that to us the other day, yawning, and we were yawning, or I was yawning after. Just make sure you try yawning with an accent. You know, that's always really weird. <laughs> what? How is that possible? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just trying to make fun of Collective, though. She's not here. She's probably lurking, you know? <laughs> Ooh, uh, Brick Grenade got my package. Awesome. Was it a grenade? No, he got uh, Darth Maul from me. Ooh. And he got some other stuff. Also, Brickholds, you know you should promote your your uh, your your contest. Your I'm not your contest. Your raffle. Anyone interested in joining in my raffle? <laughs> I got 20 spots left. I might have to refund everyone if it's not going to happen. We'll just raise the price of the tickets. What do you mean raise the price? Raise that's, it to 10 instead of 5. That's not going to work. What do you I'll mean? It, it worked before. No, I lowered it. What? I lowered it before. Really? I thought, no, the last time it was $10 an entry. Yeah, that's what I had for that one. Uh, the first one that I ever did as a raffle. But that had more attention because Mayfigure Dream shouted it out in his... Uh, his um, you know, his Instagram. So that uh, kind of helped out. But how many spots did you have available in the first place? Like twenty five? Thirty four. Thirty four. Yeah, we got down fourteen. 14 so you, you, I mean, it's not doing bad. I mean, you just got to promote it a little bit more. I promoted it. I mean, I don't know if that even helped. You promoted that late at night. <laughs> yeah, I mean, but if you look at the likes, I mean, it still did. You know, good. King. Um, I mean. I can mention it in my next video that helps. I don't know if people will. I don't do know. That. What's your next video? That I don't know. <laughs> but my next one. You have to refund the star gun. Well, if I can try and finish it off, then that'll be amazing. But yeah, I've I've only kept uh, the stuff uh, that people have sent me uh, on my PayPal. So just in case I had to refund them real quick, um, it's all on there. Because um, I got quite a few other. I still videos. think, in my opinion, you would totally the 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 shuttle thing would have totally worked out. But you you know the whole Jamie Bricks thing. You said you could trust him, and he went through with it. So yeah, it's in November time that uh, him and I would be doing that deal. So you just have to see. I have to figure out how to send five dollars. Okay, so Doc Samson's interested in. Ooh, awesome, Doc. Glad. I got one guy, Brickinade, the same guy. He said that um, he might get three entries if it gets closer to uh, closing. So that will be. I'll get another entry if it gets closer to closing, also. <laughs> okay, so there's five in the future then. And then, you know. Make... I could promote it again. I'll do it tomorrow. So I give like my Instagram followers a break and I won't do it at night so more people see it. And I'll yeah. do a video about it so then people, you know, watch it. I tried doing it today, and it did not work. A video uh, on Instagram? 
No, I, I did the post on the story, and there's 85 views, but um, no one's interested, I guess. I guess do a video on it. Sound like all enthusiasts. Like, hey, guys, today we're having a raffle for just $5. You have the chance to win this Darth Vader mini fig. If you'd like to send this money, if you're interested, send the money to PayPal. This is a very expensive mini fig and usually goes for a hundred and something dollars. So, yeah, check this out. Link in the description of my PayPal. And, yeah, let's get this thing alive. So Yeah, I would have to make it sound, like, really good. All you have to do is send in $5 or as many entries as you want. But $5 will get you a spot on this contest. Well, and you, you know, some like people might guy. not know the value of it, Burke Worlds. You know, if they know the value of the minifig, they yeah, might be more intrigued into, you know. I'll just say 170 because, you know, it is worth 170 yeah, so be like, well, does five dollars really hurt you at the end of the day? Nope. What can you buy with five? Nothing. So just you know, make it all like you know, because here's the thing: whoever wins, you know, a hundred seventy dollar mini fig for five dollars, it's a great deal. I'm living proof of the vixen. The so. exactly. I've, I've sold one before, so that was amazing. But I'm just not able to uh, sell this one. It's taking a while. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, I'm looking up right now how much uh, they're selling for on um, on Bricklink. Okay. So in the U.S., because of shipping, there's one for 160. I think why I have it. Oh, that's me. <laughs> so, just... That's your own. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> I have three of them, so I have two left at the moment. So I'm trying to get rid of them. But yeah, that's me. I'm the only one in the U.S. that has it for a fair price. See, the other one that's U.S. is 165, so only four bucks more. But you know, still has. So nice. I mean, that's you know, you're you're being factual. factual. So who wouldn't give up five dollars? Because I know that other giveaway, the one that I lost, I think ten dollars, and I didn't care at the end of the day because ten dollars doesn't hurt me. You know, I'm not gonna be like, oh, I'm homeless, I can't afford this or that. I was happy the person won, right? You know. And it was still fun. It's like lottery. Like, I love lottery stuff. That's probably why I'm even more broke. But still, I love lottery type stuff. So that doesn't, you know, bother me. Now, if you're all of a sudden go like, it's $80 a ticket. I ain't going to do that. There's no way. Yeah. Or like, you know, it, you know, I would even bet 20 It depends what it was, you know? So Yeah, that's why I was trying to do the fair price of five bucks. I, I thought that would bring in more people quicker. Uh, you just got to be more enthusiastic about it, you know? I, I feel like a party. post. I feel like a post, right? It it helps, but it's not, you know, if you're like, you know, you explain some stuff, you know, then people are more intrigued. And that's what, you know, I'll do a video doing the same thing, promoting your thing. So, uh, awesome. and I'll post it on Instagram so then people see, but I won't do that at the middle of the night. Like, we're like, hey guys, <laughs> one in the morning, guys, check out Brickworld's giveaway, you know? <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll try to make a video tomorrow because I don't really have any videos at the moment that are posted into the channel. The only video today was this free Lego stuff, which I still had to sort. That was the main purpose of this whole stream. But uh, we just got caught up with uh, chatting with everyone. That's what normally happens for my streams. Can never get anything done. Like MNR, he gets a lot done, even though he has like 140 some people watching concurrently. But he only really responds to uh, super chats, and if uh, he like glances up for a second, just responds to one little comment. So he doesn't know. I like, mean, he, I, I respect that he's able to still talk to people and you know get stuff done because like I can never do that. I can't. That's why I stopped building streams. Like people really like them because I have like an older set and I build it live. People really like those, but it was so uncomfortable because I was always like hanging upside down. The webcam would be at a weird angle. I'd be upside down, down on the side of my bed. Or I'd be in a little spot because I, most of the Lego covers my room. I'm like, I can't do this anymore. It's painful. I don't care if people like. I mean, okay, I kind of do care, but I don't care. It's not worth my pain. Yeah. You know? So. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Josh, uh, welcome back. But go, go to sleep, man. You don't have to pull an all nighter. We're not going to be going all night. Oh, you can pull an all nighter. It's okay. <laughs> all nighters are not healthy. All night long. I've tried to do them so many times, but I can just not do them. I've only done it once, and that was just the worst thing. I quit my job because of that, because <laughs> I was pulling all nighter for it. But um, yeah, don't don't do that, man. I do that sometimes. I work two jobs in one day, you know. So <laughs> do what Beefeb's doing right now, yawning and putting himself to sleep. Or no, do this. I'm not. It's just I'm yawning, but I'm not tired. It's weird. 
Take a shot of medicine with me, okay? Let's let's go. Shot, shot, shot of medicine. Uh, let's see. Oh my God! Plug in that phone, Josh, so that so if you fall asleep, the battery don't die. Yeah, exactly. Don't worry, I I already did. And grab my Bluetooth headphones. Um, all right, let me just pour this in before I mess it up. Uh. Shot done. That's the third shot that I've done on streams. <laughs> and I'm not even of age yet. <laughs> See, I'm using my iPad Pro charger and it's going slow and slower for some reason. I find that uh, my my battery gets used up pretty quickly whenever I'm uh, on a Hangouts call on my phone. So whenever I have chats with uh, BFAB and uh, Clutching Bricks, it just goes by super quickly. So it really stinks. Yeah, that's why I use my laptop. I can't use my laptop, though, for doing that. Like, joining in someone else's stream, I have to go on my phone because it just does not work on my laptop. I don't know why. Oh, that's a little weird. And watching Hulu and Netflix on my laptop, uh, it does not work. I, I, seriously. Are you serious? Yeah. I think the reason why it's like that is because I have this hooked up to a monitor and one time whenever it was not hooked up to a monitor, it worked. So I think that's the only reason why I cannot do anything like that. You need to find a good way to get fat. I cannot watch Hulu on my phone. That would be annoying as heck. I want to try and get a TV and get a Chromecast or Apple um, Apple TV so I can uh, just, you know, put it on my TV instead of doing it on my phone. But, you know, I'm so used to my phone. I, I'm just, like, scrounging around different uh, channels and such and videos looking for something to watch. Uh, on my phone instead of like um, scrolling on a TV, like I could never do that. But I guess just casting the video. I can I scroll can... on my 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 laptop. You know, it has a touch screen thing. Well, well um, scrolling, yes, on the uh, on the computer, uh, I can do that. But um, you know, sitting down for a long time, can't. Do that's that. why you lay down. You have a little box. You put your laptop on it. You lay down right, have it bed level, and you just watch stuff. That's what I do. Yeah, I used to do that whenever I didn't have like uh, a good phone like I do now. Like I just had like a flip phone or something. Um, so I, I would only use uh, YouTube on my computer. And that's what exactly I would do. I would just put it put it down on the uh, uh, on the bed. But sometimes I would actually um, flip it on its side because, you know, I'm, um, that's the direction I'm looking and such. When laying down, uh, that's what I would do. But um, I, I'd rather do my phone. And, you know, my phone's pretty big anyway, so I could definitely just do it like that. And then, you know, one day, or uh, back in the past, I had to use this small little phone uh, to watch content. You can see the difference with the sizes. Oh, it's yeah, for sure. Crazy. Like, it's so much bigger, so I love it. Uh, let's see. Do, do, do. I did not think it would matter, but apparently it does. And then I ignores the chat. Sometimes. Not, not everyone he responds to. Uh, so that's different. Uh, it's cool. I only have to last until 4.30. Why? Why do you last until 4.30? ASMR drinking video. <laughs> I would have been gagging by now if I were you. Uh, some medicine, like if I have to swallow medicine, I, I cannot do that. Like um, it's, it's hard for me to just put it down with water. Like I have to force it down, sadly, because it just does not work for me. So, um, yeah, that, that's the only thing I would really gag on because I'm kind of like gagging on my – or forcing my finger down my throat. Whoa, what are you trying to become one of those anorexic girls that like throw up or whatever? No, no, that's not. Oh, okay. I thought that's what you were saying. No. Putting medicine down my throat to feel better. Oh, okay. Medicine like this, not swallow medicine. That's the only thing that would work. Dang, the chat is dying. Yeah, the chat's dying. So that helps us out. That will mean that we will be ending here shortly. Just going to read the rest of the chat. I find the taping and scratching calming, but I don't watch the kinky ASMR stuff. Taping and scratching. What is that? Somebody getting taped up. <laughs> I don't said... understand. Like, how is that common? <laughs> I'm getting taped up right now. Please don't scratch me. <laughs> I only watch ASMR cooking videos. Oh my god, I, I hate those. 
there's like this girl named Munchies or something. She's so weird. Oh my god, do not watch ASMR videos like that. Uh, Dane the chat is dying. All 11 people say something. It's late on the East and Midwest. Yeah, it's super late right now. It's almost uh, 1 a.m. BW Donuts. I like donuts. It's not almost 1 a.m. I said, uh, or actually, I think it's 1 a.m. <laughs> almost uh, the next day, the 18th. Yes. Okay, I'm back. Welcome back, uh, Brick Boy Builder. Um, cooking is my ASMR channel. Okay. Um, John said something. Well, glad that you're still here, John. Uh, the food is so good looking when when done. <laughs> oh, man. I wish I could just take the food out of the camera and just eat it. That would be, or, uh, the monitor, that would be me. Here's almost nine. It's almost nine for you. Holy cow, you're so lucky. I wish I had that much time left. I'm going to take a shower and go to sleep. It's almost 11. Uh, I can't watch ASMR with talking. Oh my god. She found your twin. Who's it gonna be? Oh my god. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Let's stop. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's collective bricks. What are you talking about? Oh, <laughs> The same height, the <laughs> same weight. The same. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Uh, Jeez. Well, I'm proud you are catching up. You are catched up. Because, yeah, finally caught up. <laughs> I can't watch ASMR with talking. Uh, all I hear is lip specking and what else sounds like it. I know, it's just ridiculous. See you this morning, man. Thank you so much for coming. Really appreciate it. Barely 8 p.m., early evening. Man, you are so lucky, man. I, I hope one day I can move to California or, you know, with my job description and move to California. But I'll probably move um, move to the Middle East or something for my job description because <laughs> I would have to interrogate people and such. <laughs> She's not black. <laughs> um, and, uh, it's 8 here. Man, 8 p.m. So lucky. Arizona. How, how hot is it for you right now in Arizona, uh, Regal Bricks? Try to look at my temperature. It's 82 right now. How in the world? Oh, and it was 91 as the hottest. I don't believe that. Yesterday, I feel like it was uh, like 106 or something um, because we were playing soccer outside. Um, and the fields, um, it was like, I don't know why, but the fields were just making it so much hotter out there. But, you know, uh, we were all dying <laughs> with all the heat. Uh, let's see. Going to live. Uh, no, I'm not going to move to Guatemala Guatam Bay. Gu I can't say it anymore. Get Guatemala Bay. I'm just going to say Gitmo Bay because that's... Uh, Guatemala Bay. I know it's Guatemala Bay. I just can't say it. <laughs> um, doo -doo -doo. I don't know why you would want to move to Cal. It's just like there's so many opportunities in California. And, uh, my dealer, he's close by there, and I could get... Although the main set's sealed and such, <laughs> it, it would just be awesome to live in Cal. Uh, let's see, help, how do I open some Cheetos without being loud? My room is right above my parents. Oh man, um, I don't know, just do it real quick. Just do like a um, open and cough at the same time. Then it might work. Cal's boss, yeah, Cal's boss. Let's see what she posts. <laughs> Oh my god. Jeez, that message. That's crazy. It was 110 the other day. Wow. Did did annoying leave another message? Yeah, she said uh your thing jigger is super small. Um it's like the one of the worst states to live. So expensive. Cal, yeah, Cal is definitely expensive, but if I was on living on the military base, then you know. My phone must be slow, but last thing is the memes he sent. Yeah, you'll get it eventually. You got to get an iPhone now because it comes in super quickly. Cough as you, yeah, exactly what I said. Cough as you open the bag. What? That's where you can interrogate uh, to your heart's content. Uh, no, well, yeah, I, I know you can interrogate there, but um, for my job description, I would probably be over in the Middle East and um, I'd have like a a Delta squad or something, you know, like uh, one of the uh, 
um, one of the uh, deadly um, American um, uh, military units to uh, guard my back while I um, interrogate someone. Do you want to use tickle people to death? I feel like that works. I could do that. I could tickle them or try and uh, give them donuts. <laughs> give them donuts? What are you trying to call me fat for? <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to stuff you up for the uh, for the winter. <laughs> You're going to America. What? We're going to America? <laughs> do you like Black Friday? I do not. You do not like Black Friday. I need to do a video. I want to try next Black Friday. I just have like thousands of dollars on me. Trying to buy a bunch of Lego sets, like you'll see an old lady, like she's like running with a Lego set for a grandkid, and just like all like straight, like push her over, grab the set, and have, run. Have her run into your arm. <laughs> That's my little set. <laughs> no, just like straight push her over, grab her car, and then add more stuff to her car and keep running. You know. Then if people try to do that to me, like bumper cars, you know, like wham, like bam, just smash into them. <laughs> oh man. Because the collecting is so out to be, to be to uh, be fab. <laughs> I want to move to Niagara Falls, Canada in a few years. I went once and it was beautiful. I want to go see that. And I want to see um, uh, the Grand Canyon. I think those two would be amazing to see. See, FYI, as a manager of retail, I can tell you, uh, other than the door buster, <laughs> there is, excuse me, uh, no saving, <laughs> say on Black Friday. Yeah, definitely. Legos especially. Like one year... They had um, the the back cave, one of the older back caves, like a while ago or something. They had a back cave for fifty percent off, and I was trying to get both. Of, actually, no, I got both of them, and then I returned it the next couple of days after. I don't know why. It was so stupid. That was a great deal for those back caves. Well, you bought you return. Oh, I think I remember you did a video on that. No, that was no. way before I did YouTube. Really? Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, wait, are you talking about the Lego Batman movie back cave? No, it's, yeah, it's not that one. It was. Uh, one that came long before. Oh, um, the first, the 2011 one? I can't remember, but maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Dang. Yeah, I would have regretted that. I would have been like, dang. Yeah, I regret that. Uh, yeah, I think it's cheap on eBay. The thing is, one superhero sets go up in value, unless they're like the really old ones, like the ones I buy from like 2003 or 2006. And they really don't go that much up in value. Yeah. See, prices are marked up. Uh, to put a larger, larger percent savings on the, the item on that day. Yeah, yeah, it's really messed up whenever that happens. Like, uh, someone on Instagram was posting that uh, their Kmart's were um, going out of business sale or something, and they marked up their um, their Lego aisle and put twenty five percent off. So it's just still a little bit above retail for those sets. So it's not even a discount at all. It's it's just um, you know scam. Game, yep. I, I don't know what's wrong with my phone that I still can't see the message that you got. I don't know. You, you probably wake up in the morning and just see it. Let's see. Uh, I spend hours in stores on Black Friday. Really? Wow, that's crazy. Uh, my sister and I, we went to both Walmart and Target. Uh, I think we went to Target first, uh, went through uh, their little section because I think how Target does it, they have you go through one entrance. And it just loops around like you can't go through the, the normal section like uh, they only have the deals out. You can only um, go through the deals section. So it just like loops around the whole store and then it leads to all the checkout lines. And then you can exit through that one area because they <laughs> open up both sides. Oh, was this what she was at, the guy dancing in the mirror? What? I so dance, we, yeah, the mean that, That's side. something else. So, wait, so you said something before that? How can I not see it? The Here, thing is, this uh, is how you dance in the front of the mirror. No, you... Can you see this one? No, I don't see it now. Look on my screen. Oh, yeah, I see it now. Yeah. That's oh, she that's what she said. Yeah. I see. I see how this is. Let's see. That's why. I... Never mind. I was going to say something really mean. Uh, let's see. Grand Canyon legit looks look like a green screen. It is such an amazing thing. Awesome. Yeah, I'd love to see that then. <laughs> looks like a green screen. That's crazy. Ooh, I worked forty watt forty seven thousand steps this week. That's crazy low. <laughs> uh, eating before bed can give you bad dreams. 
What if you eat something good, like a donut? Will you dream about donuts? <laughs> uh, see, wait, I can go grab my scissors to open the bag. <laughs> yeah, you, you can do that too. I got scissors on hand. I uh, barely use them anymore. I just have them just because, I guess. But I mainly use my knife for all things. I have so many knives, and I'm trying to get rid of all of them. I've got just way too too much stuff. I hope we can do a garage sale here soon because I love to have extra money and less stuff. So fingers crossed that we can do that. Uh, see, I got the 2011 one for $30. Oh, nice. That's a better deal than what I was getting for. I think mine was like 40 bucks a piece. Um, see, I'm not sleeping though. Ooh, go to sleep, man. You got to. Uh, see, and you don't burn any calories of the stuff you eat right before you go to bed. So eating before sleeping makes you fat. <laughs> um, uh, oh, shoot, I don't want that. Yeah, Kmart has great back then. Uh, Kmart was great back then. Back when? When exactly? <laughs> um, Clothes Cheetos. Blue light special. That is a low blow. Low blow. Law. I don't know what, but Greg is turning into Ryan. How uh, damn gangster knife moves. He plays too much video games. What a big end. Yeah, playing Fortnite for him now, that's just ridiculous. Like, if he didn't do that before, I think he would have been a different person. Like, uh, hang out with uh, BFM and I quite a bit on our streams and such. He did that before he started playing Fortnite. Now he plays Fortnite and he no longer plays with, or hangs out with us. <laughs> yeah. And now that Blackout's coming out here soon, he's probably going to be playing that quite a bit. You guys are crazy with these text messages. Um, all right, so all caught up with the chat. Uh, Greg plays COD. Yeah, he plays COD now. I lost a friend over Fortnite, and I don't know why. Jeez, 12 watching and 19 likes. Thank you, guys. That is awesome. <laughs> People still really love this stream, which is awesome, you know? Yeah, pretty awesome. Let's see. He's a big YouTuber now and hangs with Jane. Who hangs with Jane? I don't think... Or is it Greg? Is it Greg that hangs with Jane? I think that's what you're talking about. Okay. Isn't that... Yeah, Fortnite isn't that good. Since Blackout's now out now... I, or since Blackout beta was out and um, everyone was playing it, I think Blackout's really awesome. I think so. Really good uh, game. So I want to try and get it at some point. As soon as I move, then I can set everything up. Because everything at the moment is just like a um, a uh, presentation view. Because tomorrow we're going to have pictures done throughout the house. Like uh, someone's going to be taking photos. And then this weekend we're going to be um, having an open house. So people can come in and you know observe the house and such. So everything has to be in an uh, uh, observation view, I guess. So I can't, you know, present all my Lego and such. So I got to pack all this away here um, before they come tomorrow. So that kind of stinks. But, you know, I didn't really organize it all that much. So I guess that's good. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Burkle, is that you agree to my tax message a lot? Jeez, dude. Uh, let's see. I lost my school over Fortnite. You lost your school? What? Uh, Battle Royale games are dying faster than the Brick Show. <laughs> the Brick Show dead. They're, not even de they're not dying, they're dead, they're gone. Boof, bye. Yeah. Let's see, the Baby Shark trend is beating Fortnite a little. Yeah, that was, if you guys know uh, who Daddy Brickhead is, um, I, I hope that their video uh, does even better because uh, that video is actually uh, pretty decent. What video? Their horror video? No, about the uh, the daddy shark or the uh, the uh, the shark video, the left shark. Oh, where they're dancing and stuff. Yeah. Oh, that was funny. Let's see. That was funny as heck. You know, I realize I don't have a lot of friends because most of my text messages are from eBay, like your package is here, or UPS, or something. <laughs> uh, Oh, looks like Rogue Runner quit YouTube. Really? 
Yeah, you see uh, this little thing? It's crossed off, and this is his channel. Oh, no. That... So I guess unsubscribe. Uh, we'll rip I wonder why he deactivated his account. I guess he didn't want people to know. Oh, well, I, I know he was really frustrated with certain things, so... Yeah. Yeah. I'm not seeing anyone else that quit YouTube yet. Oh, I'm quitting YouTube. Who is this guy? You know what's so weird is when people come back and you're like, who are you? Why are you doing gaming? <laughs> yeah. I don't know who this guy is. So I'm just going to unsubscribe to him. Oh, wow. He's got over a thousand subscribers. I guess he's doing well, so I'll stay sub. Um, <laughs> I wonder what Burkwell does. He's like, oh, I unsubscribed to BFAB. <laughs> no, I never did, did that. All right. Chat. Uh, I probably won't make it all night. Sadly, he did sigh. Uh, I just tracked my eBay package and it says it's supposed to be here today. Ooh. I have not had anything new in quite a while. And that's that's awesome. I'm glad that I'm not buying anything new. The last thing you know was from um, the horrible hole. Oh, how? Or actually, well, yeah, this wasn't a buy, so that's that's just free Lego. So I can't count that as you know buying anything. So let me see when the last thing I purchased was. You know what's even sad is the last time I texted my brother. I don't know why I'm saying this. Was back in June. <laughs> Ow. We even talked to my brother. Oh, I feel like this guy. And he said, what happened to your Instagram account? <laughs> your brother? Yeah. Wow. Oh, that was probably about the um, the little thing that you're trying to do. Trying well, to no, he said I had a Walmart brand of shoes and I got angry. Because people would actually think that. And so I deleted the comment and blocked him because he said some weird thing. Like one time he said I look like Chewbacca. I'm just kidding. He, he said, I look like one of the Duck Dynasty people with my beard or something on one of my videos, on, on my Instagram posts. And then he said, said some weird stuff. And like, he interacts with all the subscribers. So I just blocked him. Let's see. So it was 11 days since my last haul. So that's the last time I spent money on Lego. Nice. Hopefully I can go a month without spending money on Lego. That would be great. <laughs> See, I thought my subscription list was long. Yeah, mine's pretty long. It's not uh, as long as uh, BFAB, so it's, I'm pretty sure it's long. <laughs> Do you see the thing that we just got set? With uh, collecting bricks? Yeah. My list is only 249 subscriptions. Uh, mine are like 700 and something. Oh my god. Was that her? Yeah. Why is she saying something like that? That's crazy. <laughs> we could, she's trying to say she looks good without makeup. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, no, I don't want her to get all so She had a pose for it. <laughs> yeah, she's like... <laughs> I did send a similar photo. <laughs> you did what? I can send the same photo with the same pose. Uh, you, you should modify her uh, photo some way. <laughs> Put my face on there and stuff. <laughs> See, it's 10 10. I doubt till I be here today. I doubt I'll, it'll be here today. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's not going to arrive today for you. Sorry. You have 120 to 22 subscriptions. I have like 200, 400, 200 to 400. Yeah, I had so many before. It was crazy. I had to delete some of them. All right, guys. I think I'm going to call it quits right now. It's streamed for quite a while. So I appreciate everyone coming in. Uh, we'll see you. Oh, geez, I'm losing my voice. We'll see you hopefully here soon for another stream. Thank you all so much for coming. And have a great night. Bye, everyone.